I'll tell you who should be saying his prayers. Santa. He messes with me, I mess with him. That's why I replaced one of his flying reindeer with an ordinary non-magical one. Ah! Ah! Cut it off! Cut it off! What? Ah! You know, I think this year is gonna be the best- What? What it is, guys, it's your boy Blastmas HD, and you guys have sent me a Family Guy compilation in my DMs and said it would make me laugh. Let's do this. Yeah, Bly, I have that thought sometimes, too. Oh, hey. Hey, yourself. You, uh, working hard or hardly working? Get up here and find out. Uh, Priam, I gotta go. But Stewie... I gotta go! Hey, you wanna get in the pool? No. Oh, I'd love to, but I had active diarrhea three days ago. Oh, it's okay. The lifeguard's totally cool. Hey, guys. Uh-uh. Stewie, you want a mommy rocket ride? What? What do you mean? What Here the we hell go. is a mommy Get rocket ready for ride? Blast off. What? Oh, oh! Son of a bitch! Oh! oh my god, Stewie, are you alright? Nice throw, Casey Anthony. Oh! Morning, family. I need breakfast, Stat. Are you excited for your first day as a nurse, Dad? I am. Thanks, Mug. Meg. Mug. So, how's this gonna work, Dad? You don't know anything about medicine. Oh, there's a lot more to being a nurse than medical mumbo jumbo. For example, What's the next holiday? Memorial Day. The next one. Fourth of July. Say Christmas. Christmas. Eh? Huh? That's good nursing. If anyone needs me, I'll be in the kitchen. What? Damn it, who moved the lamp? Well, what does the rest of the family think? Chris? Ha! You got sunflowered! What? When a Gen Z kid wants out of a conversation, he leaves a large sunflower in his place. That's ridiculous. There is no way that children regularly disappear and then replace themselves with sunflowers just to express their boredom. It is if there's a hashtag tied to it. Message! Ha! <laughs> you got sunflowered again. Welcome to the Quahog Fire Department, folks. I'm Captain Beckman. Let me know if you have any questions that I can answer for you. What's up, nerds? You waiting for some guy to fall asleep with a cigarette? Lazy fire turds! Have another donut, pig! We got guns! You got hoses! See you on the softball field! Oh my god! Yeah, I agree with Chris. I don't think you have the makeup to be a nurse. You're impatient... Are you done? And you faint when you see blood. Yeah, I got over that. Pass the ketchup. What? Nah, I'm scared of needles, so I've been faking all my nursing. Oh! Ha! Okay, this one's good. You're good. Your editing needs work, but the clips Hello? are good. Hey, Quagmire, what's going on? Oh, you need a ride? Yeah, sure, I can come get you. I'm not doing anything. Meg, that was the last guy, so just lock up when you're done. Yep. No one loves you. Everyone makes mistakes. Yeah, remember when the fat man brought home that cougar chick? You make yourself comfortable, Beth. I'll be right back. Prostitute! Hi, young man. I'm looking for a good time. Uh-huh. I'm worldly. I'm fun. Prostitute. This ain't mileage. This is experience. No. Not interested. Listen, just so there are no surprises, don't be scared. My stuff looks like someone spilled an apple pie in my lap. Ugh, yuck. As long as the hole still works, we're good. Throw some Astro Glide on it, and it all looks the same. <laughs> <sighs> That's depressing. You're having a lot of those tonight. I think there's a new This Is Us. Mm. 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 Babe, no, I'll show. Mm. 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 What's Kate up to this week? Losing weight with Toby, maybe? You ever want to know how a dude is gay? This is one of the signs right here. Trying to get it popping, and he's trying to watch daytime television. Why you not have sex with me? Yeah, run the cheeks, nigga. No, I know. I totally want to. It's just, it's our show, you know? What? Thanks for the ride. One of my tricks drove me here from the clam, and I didn't have any money for a cab. Tricks. Why not? Didn't she just pay you? No. After it was over, she said she wasn't going to pay. Well, that ain't fair. You can't let these women take advantage of you like that. What apartment is she in? I'll go talk to her. She's in Unit 17. You know, if you're going back in anyway, can you grab my belt? It's reversible, so I'd hate to lose it. <laughs> ah, bird strike! We hit a goose! I'm going down! I'm going down! What? Nope. Not today. <laughs>
Nice Denzel Washington landing. I only say that because I don't know what movie I just referenced. Yeah, so hey, that you didn't pay my friend, so I'm gonna play with your doorbell until you pay up. No. no. Stop it! I can do this all day. I love buttons. Fine, here's your money. Here you go. Peter, this is amazing. Thank you. Hello. Uh, my name is Lois Griffin, and I am blind. Who, who's that? Is that Lois? Peter, I'm the one who's blind. Sorry, I, I'm still getting used to things. <coughs> I gotta say, some days I wish I didn't have a sister. <sighs> he has a sister? What? Nothing. Oh, I thought you asked me what was going on with my sister. No. I did no, not. No. Oh my god. What's wrong with 817? I can see. Oh god, but if anybody finds out, it'll ruin my ICU brand. What? Ugh, Peter told me he'd been doing laundry. Now, now I'm even wondering if he lost those 75 pounds like he said. What's that, Lois? I'm just on the spin bike. Got a good sweat going. Boy, you're right. Sarah loves those hills. Wow! Ryan, what are you doing down there? They didn't set a place for me. Not a dog family. Oh. Go away. Go away, you. <laughs> but, Mom, we got you a balloon. Shh, 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 shh. She doesn't know about the balloon. Don't worry, Lois. We'll be right by your side the whole time and not outside playing with a balloon. <laughs> I love you, balloon. Is it bad that I tried to bone a blind female a couple months back? <laughs> <laughs> I realize how bad that sounds. Yeah, I'm saying. But I would have treated her right. <laughs> I got a letter of recommendation for you. When I first met Peter, I was impressed in how tall and handsome he is. That's coming from Big Bird? Ryan Reynolds was on Sesame Street. Wow. Also, have you ever noticed that Grover and Super Grover are never in the same room at the same time? As I said, Lois, not two days ago. Where do you get off? In my bedroom, mostly. Sometimes the bathroom, or wherever I see a lady seal an envelope. Good, good. <laughs> Yesterday, Meg sat there without pants. Yuck. Wow. I remember when my parents clapped their hands after moving something one time. You never forget those moments. Now remember, Meg, I want you to call us every week, and then every few weeks, and then never. I promise, Mom. Look, honey, we're sorry, and we want to do something special for you. This is a Hamilton Beach blender we got on our wedding day. It keeps coming back to us in a vicious re-gifting cycle. Hey, you know what? Here's a little something for your trouble. You're giving me a cut? Wow, thanks! Hey, maybe you could drive me around and help me out, and I could even pay a little something for your time. Sure, that sounds great. And you know what? It'll be nice having a little extra cash to bet on college football. Yeah, I'd like to bet a hundred bucks. You want to pick a team? No, just take it. Heads up! Ow! Dad, what the hell? Did you join a frat? I tried to, but I got the letters mixed up and joined a frat. <laughs> Peter, your comic in this morning's paper is really offensive. This washer. That's just not. That's it. That's it, footy as hell, bro. Oh, my dishwasher broke. <laughs> it's your girlfriend. Not getting it, Lois. See, his wife washed dishes for him. Oh, for Pete's sake. Ah, there you go. Hey, ladies, toga Friday tonight at I Delta PU. Tell your friends. Ew, no. <laughs> they all say that. Hey, what are you reading? Boning up for an exam. I boned up yesterday when I walked into the girl's shower. Dad, please! Sorry, Meg, I've been smoking doobies all morning. Talk about higher education. That's it! I can't take this anymore! Dad, get out of here! What? This is what college is. 
Hey, Lois, you see my hiking boots? I need them later for park soccer. Peter, why the hell do you look like that? Uh, my name isn't Peter. My name is Justin. I'm living a Justin lifestyle, and so is my family. What? Wanna go to a loud concert? No. How about Justin takes his shirt off, and we can get some photos of you on Justin's belly? Your heartbeat is weird. It is not consistent at all. Okay, let's go for a ride in my open Jeep. I took the doors off, so it's extra terrifying. What? Hey, Chris, did you tell everyone the big news? <laughs> no, it's stupid. Come on, tell them. Well, I got into Orange Julia's school today. That's wonderful, Chris. Unique. Tell them what the guy said, Chris. He said I was lucky I was the only one who applied. You're being too modest. Anyway, I've already been fired for touching myself while the hot dog on a stick ladies made lemonade. Oh. It sure is fun going on a picnic, isn't it, Peter? Yeah. Will you hold this beer bottle while I try to kick the top off it? Oh! You moved it! Oh, my God. Run, ho! <laughs> Spend the money on podcast. Today's episode, expressing your dog's anal glands. Just no. spend the money. It can't cost more than, ah. I don't know, 30 bucks? $30 is three months of Netflix. Ah. So don't watch The Crown for three months. Lois, can we just can we just kiss a little first? You know what? I, I think it's actually starting to clear up on its own. Whoa, Black Betty, bam a lamb. Hey, Black Betty, bam a lamb. What? <laughs> what? Hey, what the hell's going on? Oh, Santa, I I'm sorry. I, I didn't realize this was your car. That's right. Now crumple up that ticket. Now eat it. All right, now we're going to go to your home and wait for you to pass it, and then you're going to eat it again. Hey, honey, this is Santa. He's going to come in and watch me in the bathroom. Oh, just like the Easter Bunny did. <laughs> exactly. I got a lot of guys coming through here. This is so hard. I can't do this, Mom. Come on, keep pushing, kids. We're almost there. Oh, I'm feeling nauseous. I think I got altitude sickness. Hey, Brian, you want a pukesicle? I would love a pukesicle. So, you want to go upstairs? Sure. Great. Go. Oh! I'm sorry, Peter, but the production just can't deal with all your nonsense anymore. We're letting you go. Oh, please, don't do this! I'm begging you, just give me one more chance! <sighs> Okay, fine. All right, that's it. You're fired. All right, Griffin's on the ground. We're going to second. Let's turn two here. Ground ball's a double play. Ball plays at second. Let's look sharp. Tough D, tough D. Let's flash that leather. Head in the game. Plays a second. This infield is a great wall of China. Nothing's getting past us. Good D behind you, Bri. Good D all around. I'm okay, everyone. Don't worry. I am okay. My voice sounds weird. This is weird, I know, but I feel fine. Hmm. Nice, thick card stuck. Ah, yes, that's a very bright white. Ooh, Century Gothic font. Miss, this store is for tiny farts only. There's a lids next door for that sort of thing. <laughs> I'll take a look at those storm clouds. Oh, that doesn't look good. That doesn't look good. That's not good. That's not good. Oh, my God. Yeah, looks some clouds make it look like Voldemort's coming out this hole. It's closing in fast. We're all gonna die! All right, everyone get into a hilarious pose, so when they dig out our bodies, they'll have a good laugh. Huh. <laughs> this guy's pretty funny. Look, I don't know who brought this on, but maybe it's for the best. All right, fine. You bastards can fire me, but at least I'm leaving with my dignity. Have a good life, Mr. G. Your penis is out. And look, if you really want to learn how to bang that thing, there's no better teacher than your old dad. After all, I'm the guy who taught old Asian people how to get on the subway. Ah! Out of the way! Nobody else matters! Ah! 
All right, you made it. Now twirl that long hair sticking out of your face mole. And cough. Cough like you never coughed before. <laughs> that especially works now that COVID is a thing. Yeah, you know I'm saying you're trying to get somebody's seat. <laughs> People who move right out your way, tried and true. I've tested it before. That's how I got to where I am today. Oh, oh, oh. It's got What's wrong with you? Oh, it's my back. It's killing me. Wow, if you're in that much pain, I better tell Lois. Ugh, please don't. Then she'll drive me to the doctor, and I hate being in the car with her. Oh, baby, don't say a word. Okay, I guess that's not my part. Would anyone like to lead the family in a holiday prayer? I'll tell you who should be saying his prayers. Santa. He messes with me, I mess with him. That's why I replaced one of his flying reindeer with an ordinary non-magical one. <laughs> ah! Ah! Cut it off! Cut it off! Oh, 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 oh. Ah! You know, I think this year is gonna be the best... <laughs> Oh! Hey, free horse! No! What? Free? That's weird. They... they just left? Huh, thought you kids didn't take naps. Now you're all just sleeping at the bottom of the pool. Oh my god! A family all your own? Yes, a family just like this, in fact, with a fine son just like you, Peter. A son to whom I could one day give a piece of sour plum candy. <gasps> Thank you, Mama Trisha. But a lazy son who does not make me proud? Peter, that son deserves no candy. She's gonna have to be sucking a whole lot of penis in order for me to be her son. Well, I got a leaf. <sighs> yeah, I gotta be honest, I'm having a blast. You know, now that I'm not tied down by the show, it's given me more time to pursue my true passion, weaving sexually explicit tapestries featuring the minions. Did you have any questions about the artist? Why is Meg here? Uh, something happened last week and she can't be left alone. Like, legally. Meg, where you going? Come on, Meg, you gotta stay by me. I wasn't gonna do anything. Look, it's just a few months. Next. Hi, three adults and one infant, please. Nice try, lady. That kid's at least three. What? That's insane! Brian, do I look old to you? You look fine. So, Peter, a real job. Trading futures, that's not real. <laughs> but the money is unreal. That's it, Fishman, shirts off. I wanna see who's got bigger pecs. Peter! Well, they look better when they're roiled up. Pass the salad dressing. Oh, what? no, it's an almost empty squeeze bottle. Hang on. What? Yeah, it's all out. There's dressing on that salad. Give me that salad. Yeah, who's the better man now, Ross? I can't believe this. Daryl, Hannah, it is an absolute pleasure. I loved you in Splash. No, Doctor, this is Stewie. He needs you to help fix his face. Oh, absolutely. I can do that. Great. Is it a simple procedure? Oh, sure. We just break every bone in his face and then smush him back into position. Dr. Hartman, where'd you get your medical degree from? I went to BU. You know our fight song, right? Doi, 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 Oh, boy, the Marshalls is now a Nordstrom. I feel like our days at this mall are numbered. Well, we have $60. Let's see what kind of Chinese pressed board garbage we can get to replace my grandmother's priceless mahogany table. Dad, look, Santa's here. I want to sit on his lap. Jeez, Chris, come on. You're in high school. <laughs> hey, Chris. I, I see you're sad and also sitting on the remote. Sometimes when life's got you down, you, you got to stand up for a second. Like, like, just for a second. I've never felt this sad. Oh, looks like somebody could use a hug. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, no, I hit input. We've got a better chance of beating them if we go up the south face. Oh, we don't need a map, Brian. I got us a GPMS machine. Go up. 
What do you think? Just go up. Sorry. Okay, can everyone just stop freaking out and just give me like two minutes? God! <laughs> Everyone's always yelling at me. What? Are, all the questions. All right, well, maybe we'll turn you on later and see how you feel. Jeez, you are not going to let this go, are you? You're as stubborn as a four-hour erection. Oh. Well, she's long gone, so uh, you can go too. Oh, no. You got me for another three and a half hours, pal. Go oh. ahead. Seek medical attention. I'm not going anywhere. You <laughs> can't stay. I'm chaperoning my daughter's Girl Scout dinner in 45 minutes. Well, tuck me into your waistband and try not to pee up your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> well, keep that freakish thing under wraps. I don't want it cramping my style while I'm macking on toddlers. Oh, what? Yeah, there it is. That makes way. Yep. See you around, bitch. Ooh. It's because you just had to stop for ice cream. Then you get in there and you order like you never heard of food before. Oh, coffee fudge swirl with Reese's peanut butter cups. Oh, I wonder what's in that. You just listed off all the ingredients. Everything you just said is what's in that. Stewie, I think you're overthinking this. No, no, you're right, you're right, Brian. I'm with Rupert now. I just need to forget Oscar, no matter how intense our relationship was. What the hell? No! What? What does the blood That's represent? That's amazing. It's like you took all the colors that exist and said, here's a new one. What? Well, good. You were just slowing me down anyway. You, Asian lady, you're the new Lois. I will have one scoop <gasps> of mint chocolate chip in a waffle cone. You're a practical, straightforward people. Yay! <sighs> this is more painful than sitting through those parent-teacher cheetah meetings. Oh. So, in short, your kids are all doing great. Keep reading to them every night, and I think we're going to have a great year. So, unless there are any questions, thank you all for coming. Uh, yeah, I noticed the hot lunch menu doesn't feature any gazelle. Ah. <sighs> I'll bring that up to the board. Yeah, see, I, I, I heard that last year, and <laughs> here we are again. Stewie, relax. You're getting all worked up over nothing. Says the guy who freaks out every time a fire engine goes by. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Peter, Peter, you hear that? <laughs> I'm matching the sound. <laughs> <laughs> Is what I'm doing helping? <laughs> Meg, are you okay? You guys, I've tried everything, but it's hopeless. He's going to kill me. I can already picture my funeral. Thanks, didn't want to pay for the hole. Oh, no one wants to pay well, for I'm the hole. I'm awake now, Brian, and I know what I got to do. Well, before you do anything, for God's sake, put some clothes on. Brian, calm down. In some countries, this is a compliment. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my goodness. Mmm. This food is oh, please, ah! come on, it's just something I threw together. Oh! Look, I miss Brian more than any of you, but at least now no one's forcing us to watch those awful PBS documentaries. That's real. And now, PBS presents yep. Albino Children Are Normal. No, so, I mean, yeah, with they the are. exception of not being able to go out in the sun, you're completely normal? Yes, the moon is my sun. I like to kill beetles. Beetles are teachers. Mm. I sleep with a fork. What? Who we now return to Miracle on 134th Street. Everyone's had sex oh with a fork. Oh my god, I left my phone in my car. Wow, it's still there. Oh! Oh! What? I got some racist books. I haven't been this grateful since I met the sane hatter. Excuse me, how do I get back through the looking glass? Oh yeah, take two lefts, and it's the first door on your right. Cool, great. Thanks for not giving me the runaround. I asked that guy over there, but he just told me a bunch of rhyming nonsense. Oh, yeah. He's like a well-known dick. Mm. My God, ten losses in a row? This whole season's been one long bad dream. Yeah, like that one where I walk into the bank and I ain't got no clothes on. Sir, what are you doing? You have no clothes on. Ah, must be having one of those dreams again. Better wake myself up. Ugh. Oh, thank God. Well, time to apply for this small business loan. I'm sorry I dragged you around the world looking for God. I guess it was a huge waste of time. Like bringing a married guy to Vegas. So I'm thinking steakhouse. Do they have salad? I can't eat red meat. Yeah, then we hit the tables. I'm already down 30 bucks. Maybe the sports book? Is that near Caesars? I gotta get Brandy a Celine Dion t-shirt. Mm. And then the strip club. Guys, we have a 7 a.m. tea time. And are we just gonna bail on the Hoover Dam? Peter, come on, are you serious? If Joe or I found this, we'd want you right alongside us. Well, yeah, we're like peas in a pod. Wait, wait, don't go in there. He 
He's doing his podcast. Oh, that's cute. Now that I like. Mm. What do you think about this, you old bag? Oh, no. What? What are you talking about? Just that when you were younger, you were as passionate and full of life as him. No, that's not passionate. Hey, or, boys! That's not catch me if you can! It's not full of life. You about to be full of something. Oh, yep. crap. I didn't realize they had bikes. <laughs> yep. What are you going to do when they catch me? You're going to get stuffed. Oh, boy, I got a back of the head punch coming. I just uh, know it. You got the back of something punch. We now return to Captain Central America. Captain Saberhole. It worked. Gracias. What are my powers? Oh, yeah. It's weird. You're, like, really good at painting my living room. Up, up, and get it done by Saturday. Oh! We're having a party. What? We never go anywhere anymore. That's racist. Stagnant. What are you talking about? We go places. We took that helicopter tour of Tucson. Wow, I've never seen so many boats not near bodies of water. That park is all concrete. Look, there's a dog tied to our other dog. Oh. I think that guy with long hair is a lawyer. Look at all those students running for their lives. Oh, there's the concrete park again. You know, Quagmire, I feel kind of bad leaving the family like this with Thanksgiving coming up. I mean, if I'm not dead, who's going to carve the turkey? I don't understand! Oh! She's not fat! What? I, I figured the day you came home with a girl, we'd have to back her through the garage. Oh! A little further. Little hey! Further. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's whoa. not gender sensitive. Okay, all right. Now, do you prefer fatty or Miss Boombaletti? That is racist to fat people. We now return to slightly too early comedy club audience member. Oh. Not like when Clinton was in the White House, huh? When Clinton was in the White House, all you needed to vote was a piece of duct tape. And <laughs> oh. Yes, yes. Yep. But things That's are different what, with at... the Republican majority. They're totally in the pocket of the oil companies. I mean, the president of the United States might as well be. <laughs> yeah. Hey, man, why not? Why not, right? Yeah. But I guess it could be worse. The other day, my wife asked me if her ass looked fat in her jeans. And I'm like, honey. Oh, no. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> That's douchey. We That's now return douchey. to 11 angry men and one developmentally disabled man. Okay, the vote is 11 for guilty and one for kitty. Oh. What? All right, let's keep talking it out. Has the jury reached its verdict? We have, Your Honor. We find the defendant, Kitty. Whoa! Ah! Nigga. Peter, come on, get dressed. We're late for church. I don't want to go to church. I always feel like that priest has it in for me. Body of Christ. Yep, there it is. Body of Christ. That's cocaine. Butt of Christ. Oh, uh, Lois, trade me. No. Do you like crab? There's a knockout crab place right around the corner. The hell are you doing? I'm using my knowledge of the local food scene to get this woman to go to bed with me. Oh my God. Oh my well, God. Now we know. I can taste what he eats. Oh God. Why? Jeez, I don't know what's going on with him. But I guess love does funny things to people. Does Look it? Look at Forrest Gump. Hi, Forrest. I know you just got back from Vietnam and you love me, but no. I'm gonna go run a train with this group of Black Panthers I just met. Sam! Okay, Jenny. Sam! Hi, Forrest. I know you came all this way to no. New York to visit me, but I'm gonna go do blow and have sex with a bunch of stockbrokers. Yeah. Sam! Okay, Jenny. Sam! Hi, Forrest. Now that I have the most contagious and incurable disease known to mankind, I'll finally have pity sex with you. Okay, Jenny. And I'll mow the grass and raise the AIDS, baby. Message! Well, women can do anything nowadays. I guess you're right. Message! It's not like it's the 1950s. So, I see you graduated number one in your class from Princeton. That's right. And I'm certified as an accountant and also have a law degree. That's all very impressive. We'll keep you in mind. Let's see. Pointy boobs, medium pointy boobs, ah! not so pointy boobs. It's really like that! That's a shame. Yeah! Ah, it's the this truth! Is just one of those things he won't let up with. Ah! Like he was guest hosting inside the actor's studio. Jeff Daniels, what is your favorite Care Bear? I, I, I don't know any of the Care Bears. Right, oh. if you had to pick one, who would be your favorite? Well, like I said, I'm not really familiar. You can just say the color. I know all the Care Bears. I, I don't know. The blue one. There's like 11 blue ones, Jeff. Are you here to dick around or you want to do inside the actor's studio? Do you know what I did last week? I time-traveled ahead to Christmas so I wouldn't have to wait all year for the new toys to come out. Wow, good timing, little fella. This just came out today. Uh, yeah, I kind of knew that already. Would you like to donate an extra dollar to the Quahog Food Bank? Oh, sure. And would you like to come home and clean my toilet while we're both doing stuff oh! for each other? 
Oh! All right, fellas, open mic at the library. Your first gig. Go get them. Hey, do I have time to the get library? a drink at the water fountain where the water does not crest above the dispenser? Sure. I can taste the previous person's cough. That's not good. Oh, my God, you hear that, Quagmire? We're on our way. We got to celebrate like girls in their 20s. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, that, that is funny. Oh, my God. <laughs> we are so should, random. Everyone should take those pictures. The nerve of your dad taking the fun out of Christmas like some kind of gluten-free Santa. Hey, hey, what's in these? Mm. I'm okay if it's like coconut flour, but anything with actual grains, I can't do. I'm not sure. Well, who is sure? Oh. Well, maybe I can stir up some quail or pheasant with my patented bird calls. Birds, quail, pheasant! Come on out! I'm a bird of the opposite sex who's interested in mating! Scar! <gasps> Did you hear that? We're gonna get laid! Billy, Billy, come on. Don't be stupid. Peter, what are you doing? I'm watching this awesome show, Brian. See, they took all these colors, and they're making them all live together in a beach house. Now, the red one is sleeping with the green one, and the blue one thinks he's gonna have a career in music, and the yellow one is just a total bitch. Peter, that's just a channel that's gone off the air. And we'll be right back with more Color Bar Beach House after these messages. Oh. Ah, uh, this is my favorite part of the game. When two drunk guys, each holding a baby, get into a fist fight. You're stupid! No, you're stupid! Oh, now their wives are getting into it. They're gonna put their cigarettes in their mouths and bump boobs. You got no oh, class, you yeah. bitch! No, yep. you got no class! Yep. Now here comes security to kick out the wrong person. Yep. Come on, Miyagi, take that karate. Yeah! <laughs> oh, man, this what is my biggest it? accomplishment since my 1920 solo flight across the Atlantic. Come on, Miyagi, take that martial arts shit somewhere else. Oh. Viva Pierre Griffon! Incroyable! Don't look in there. Don't look in there. It's all craps. All right, we got to put toilets in these things if we're going to be in them for more than two hours. Ah, uh, Chip, I am going to show you all kinds of cool stuff. My Hot Wheels, my lawn darts, even my new musket. Uh, musket? Peanut, what the hell are you doing? Lois, I thought I heard a noise downstairs. Yep. Go stall them for 20 minutes and pray that it's not too damp in here. Mm. <laughs> right, this is my home, and a man's home is his castle. Halt, wench! Stage nope. your business. Peanut, will you please put down the drawbridge? I got a car full of groceries. Hmm. Anything else? I also went to the video store and got Garfield, a tale of two kitties. Guess what? Uh, I hope this isn't about your podcast again. Why? Did you finally listen to it? Yeah, it was just 15 minutes of you listing all the hats you could think of. Sherlock Holmes hat, football man hat, angry working class Irish idiot hat, Underwear because you're a cat in a laundry basket hat. Vietnamese, the sun is my enemy hat. Halloween mask that I flip up to eat my candy hat. College guy wearing a pizza box hat. Blue hat. I think that's all the hats. Trust me, you should take my advice. I mean, I'm the guy who told Michael Chiklis to wear tight shirts. I'll tell you anything you want. Just get your boobs out of my face. Oh. You know the difference between you and me, dirtbag? No matter how muscular I get, I will never be muscular. <laughs> what? Now, the Catholics believe that as long as you that. accept Jesus before you die, anyone can get into heaven. Really? Anyone? I accept Jesus as my Lord and Savior. Yep. Oh, I bet. Yes. Finally, I'm above the law, like my 14th century ancestor, King of Denmark, Griffin. More wine, more women, more table. <laughs> I'm having a heart attack. Is anyone at the table a doctor? I am. Come here, hurry, run. But the very far away doctor couldn't make it in time. And that's why here in Denmark, we have very small tables. We're supposed to stick together. Like goatee guys at a barbecue. Do you mind if I stand next to you while we eat standing? No problem. Hey, let's go grab some good beer, even though we brought the bad beer. And these two barbecue scumbags formed a lifelong friendship until their deaths at the ripe old age of 52 in separate ATV accidents. 
Now, you guys don't know nothing about staying up late. I used to pull all-nighters when I worked for that lesbian carpet cleaning company. Lesbians have regular carpets, too, you pervs. When you're done with that, can you help me plug the hole in this dike? Oh, no. I'm kind of a jack of all trades. Hey, oh, I bet. Fix this gash. Ooh, how can I've that be? Having scissor fights on this thing. How can that be sexual? God, I can't get any peace and quiet in this house. Well, now you know how I felt at Mardi Gras. Hey, keep it down. Trying to get some sleep up here. Show us your boobs. My boobs? I, I don't think I. Oh my jewelry! Well, I wonder what I'll get for showing this. The rules of this city are very unclear. <laughs> Show us your Trust balls. me, Mom. I know what I'm doing. That's what your father said before he took that walking tour of Providence. This is where a homeless man ate the finger of another homeless man. This is where some teenagers beat a gay guy to death. This building used to be Irish. Now it's Cambodian. And this is where fake tour guides throw rocks and steal tourists' wallets. Oh, yeah, I read about this part on Yelp. Oh, no! What? That's not nice. <laughs> Get a man with a rock. Like, you gotta oh, ask him first. I'm back! Oh, damn it, I left my chapstick in the past. Chapstick. With smooth lips, I will finally be able to be a mayor who kisses babies with confidence. Hey, cracked lips! You'll see. You'll all see. That's why you gotta call the child a whore. Oh, finally, something in my life that makes me feel special. Shut up, I mean, except for when I had those cow waters. So, as you can see, the fiscal projections for the fourth quarter make this thing a slam dunk. Any questions? Not uh -huh. about my cow waters. All right, then. Looks like we got ourselves a deal. This is cause for Why celebration. Why are his titties so big? No! No! <laughs> I don't care. I'm Close not your mouth! Close your mouth! Yeah, the map is a joke. You can't oh, wait for a fool. Like George McFly. Hey, Lorraine. Whatever happened to that guy, Marty, from high school? Don't know. Never saw him after the prom. Really? Sure you didn't run into him, oh, say, about 16 years ago? George, what are you talking about? I'm talking about the fact that our son, who you insisted we name after that guy, Marty, looks exactly like him. You think I'm an idiot? That I wouldn't notice that our son is a dead ringer for the guy who fixed us up? Yes. Mom, Dad, I accidentally set fire to the living room rug. Yes. I am not going easy on him. Oh, shit! Oh! Oh! <laughs> shit, I'm about to kick the shit out of this child. Well, that stuff sounds exhausting. I'm just being honest, like George Washington. George, did you chop down our cherry tree? I cannot tell a lie. Yes. And what is this pamphlet I found under your bed called the Boston He Party? <laughs> what? Not mine? The Boston God, He I'm Party? I'm so nervous. Thank God Stewie's too little to understand. Look at him over there playing that board game. Ooh. Ah, uh, three. Okay, one. Two, sorry. Sorry, the board game that teaches you to be a dick. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Quagmire. I'll take any help I can get. I haven't been this scared since my dad stopped showering for six months. Great meatloaf, Mom. Thanks, honey. Hungry! Hungry! Pour food on my pile! That's bad. Okay, Peter. Here you go. Oh. Mm. I will assimilate this new smell into the larger borg of my smells. No. Boy, Stewie was really upset about the Christmas carnival being canceled. He's been acting out all week. I'm sure he'll be over it in no time. Besides, how much trouble can he cause? He's a baby. <laughs> oh! She didn't deserve that. You sure you don't want to stay for the show? Nah, this place gives me the creeps. Like when I went to that pedophile opera. We are proud to present Mozart's The Magic Flute in A Minor. <laughs> and you still won't give us an Emmy? Come on! If Modern Family did that joke, you'd be carrying them around on your shoulders. Mm -hmm. Wedding DJ florist? Because, Chris, it takes time to plan a perfect wedding. You don't want to jump the gun. You know, like when you respond to a text too quickly. Oh! My wife's going to be reading 10 to 12 of her short story. We now oh. return to VH1's Behind the Music, Dr. Teeth and the Electric Mayhem. Oh, no. Must have been around 1979 when animals started snorting crushed up pieces of felt. Got pretty ugly. Me had big problem before me found God. He, like, threw me down and he said, I hope your puppeteer has big hands because I'm not using lube. Oh, me shit. Me don't remember that, but me believe it happened. 
I'm right I don't here. remember none I'm of it. I'm leaving. Bonnie invited me to the shooting range. What? Yeah, Bonnie says she goes every week. <laughs> I think next time you should bring someone else. Oh. You see, my wife thinks I'm an idiot. She's always making me feel small and insignificant, like John Goodman's heartbeat. Honey, my inside left boob stomach did that thing again. You mean your heart? Um, I don't know about any of that, but I think I should eat something. Oh, look, you can go to Oral Roberts. Oh, and there's Anal Roberts. Oh! Yeah, boy, that is a tough, tough place to get into, Lois. Yep. That is tough. But once you're in there, you'll of... be surprised how much you like it. Yep, got to spit on this it. This is great, Dad. I know. I'm having even more fun than when I... I mean, than when we went Fiona apple picking. Uh -huh. Dad, they're all bruised and filthy. Yeah, these might be throwing at Buss's apples, not eating apples. Why do See, all Matt, of those you apples... you be in the flashback, because we're friends now. Why do all of those apples look like they Matt sell vagina? college. You know, I always thought she was going to be one of those ladies who wears a jean jacket and hangs out at the bar in a chain restaurant. Hey, you know you can get a slice of pineapple in your burger here. Hey, Jimmy, another water. Call Miller Lite water. Jimmy knows me. He knows that. Come on, hockey team! This one's on me. Merry Christmas, Meg. Oh! You need to cool down first, Lois. Find a way to channel your anger. What I do is throw a shot put into a crowd and make it look like an accident. Yep, there it is. Oh! I forgot to make it look like an accident. That's not funny. Where's the joke? These guys are a little sharper than my old family. I still remember our duck, duck, goose disaster. Jack? 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 Jack, 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 Jack. Oh, Jack, Jack, Jack. Mm. Mexican. Yeah. They're always Jack. cooking chickens. What is that other word? That's not racist, is it? Ah, Lois took the bike. Hey, wait a minute. This is a great time for me to do my Suzuki Samurai promo. Are you a Hawaii scumbag? Do you chug energy drinks in Arizona? Suzuki Samurai. Ninja name, Garbage Car. Oh. Hey, thanks for helping me pick out a new computer, you guys. Oh, no problem, Quagmire. God, this place is always so crowded. We gotta find someone who works here. Can I help you, sir? Sorry, all I got is a quarter, pal. That's Excuse racist. me, sir. Uh, my buddy here is oh! looking for a computer. I would like to elect you president. It'd be like that. It really is like Foreigner? that. We're not foreigners. Sorry, Mrs. Griffin. Not only did you destroy your passports, you renounced your citizenship. When did we do that? Oh, I did that on the Italian social networking site. Shut up, you Facebook. Doctor, what about Viagra or Cialis? What about them? Well, if Peter could try them, they might help with his problem. Those are for man troubles? I've been prescribing them as antidepressants. Everything's just getting harder and harder. You guys do whatever you want. I got stuff to do anyway. I gotta get ready for my bar mitzvah. Baruch Atah Adonai. I want fancy things like my friend Ephraim. Oh. I want the newest 10-speed bicycle that I will ride once, but then I will call my parents and have them come get me. Is it bad that whenever I see a Hanukkah or any other type of Jewish setting, all I see is the HYFR music video by Drake with Lil Wayne up in there? Tons of scantily clad Jewish women with their titties all mashed together. That <clears throat> I mention her titties only because of how good the art in the music video was. I, I wouldn't watch videos for naked women. I want to swim in the pool, but only with my shirt on. I want to lose my virginity at 24, but tell everyone I was 16. Oh. Come on, you think the fat man's gonna figure out those clues? He's an idiot. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yes, I mean, he's the guy who put all those little bald men in incubators because he thought they were babies. Look at you. Oh. You came early, but you're going to make it. I'm a senior vice president at an investment firm. Oh, oh someone's a fussy britches. Oh. Don't you remember how much money your father wasted so he could make grand staircase entrances? That's really hey, bad. Peter here? Uh, hang on. Peter! Why, Glenn Quagmire, it's been ten years if it's been a day.
staircase ain't even that long. Uh, maybe sometime you could take me on a ride-along with you. Show me the neighborhood. Yeah, I don't take people out on ride-alongs anymore. I, I had a bad experience with Grimace. I gotta be honest, I can't get a beat on you, man. Oh my god, he looks like a killer. He look, yeah, I had to drop my nunchuck to that one. Oh no. Sorry, Mort, but this is a cutthroat business, and we need someone tough in our corner, like Indonesian kickboxer Raghus Banwadi. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Disappear, disappear. Come on, come on. It's been three weeks, and you haven't had a single job lead. Now, that's not true. I came really close with that job at the school. So what makes you want to be a crossing guard? I don't know. I just thought it would be cool to decide which kids do and don't get hit by a car. We now return to Saving Private Ryan, brought to you without commercial interruption by Mazda. <coughs> oh! Oh, I love this fight scene! Yeah! No! No! Turn it around! Turn it around! No! No! <laughs> you tricked me! You're as bad as those predators yeah. on the internet! That's wild, Stacy. I'm a 12-year-old girl, too. My name's Jenny. Wanna come over to my place and help me move? Hey, you're not a 12-year-old girl. Neither are you, Jenny. Huh. I guess we aren't so different after all. Yeah. You know, this isn't a whole lot of stuff. We can probably knock this out in an hour. And I thought maybe you and I could finally go fishing like we've been talking about. Ah, oh, sorry, Chris, I can't. I got insanity practice. Ah! 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 What's up, pinwheels! Boy? Pinwheels in my head! Voices! Angry fish! Oh, boy. How's he doing? Not good. He still thinks this is practice of some sort. Ah! Yep, We now is. return to At The Movies with two guys who watch the films on their iPhones. Good evening. First off, we're going to review Paul Greengrass's Captain Phillips. What did you think, Bill? Well, it got off to a great start, but when it was my turn to play words with friends, it really took me out of it. Well, that's a shame, because visually... Ooh. Ooh. When we come back, the guys will review American Hustle. Hmm? Let me out! You can't keep me in here forever! I have too many plans for the future! I'll never win a Nobel Prize! I'll never be a member of Parliament! I'll never get to express disappointment with young people while putting in my dentures! Oh, Stupid younger generation. Back in my day, we had Katy Perry, Justin Bieber. It's not better. It was real music. I mean, was it? It can be, but not every time. Out. Boy, that was a close one. Ah, my son was in the back seat. Yo! What type of... What type of shit? Oh my god! Oh! Oh my, what in the lord? Daddy? Oh! Morris, are you using the Elmo toothbrush, which is mine? Oh, sorry, Peter. I've just been so distracted with this whole Connie thing. Shit! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So Connie made you mistake a monster's face for the words Oral B. Come on, Peter. I'm serious. This is a real problem. Well, if she's really ruining your life, go down to the station and talk to Joe. I'd like to report somebody using the wrong toothbrush. Have a seat, sir. Tell me everything. Okay, you know Elmo, right? Hello, what? neighbors. Joe, you can walk. Please, come in. Oh, I'm so glad everyone could make it. Stan, I need $50. What the hell kind of dog is it? I was going to ask the same thing. Oh, uh, that's our alien Roger, but nobody can know. Hello? Oh, hey, Quagmire. Hey, you're not going to believe this. I'm over here with Joe, and he's got a space alien. <laughs> Peter, wake up! What the hell? Hey, pal, what are you doing? This is our bar. Not anymore. Horace owed more than this place is worth, so it's the banks now. I'm sorry, but the drunken clam is permanently closed. Closed? That was the start of the dark times. The Bro. banks took our bars, our businesses, and then our homes. A change had to be made. A change only one man could make. I am the wind maker. And I what? shoot monkeys now. What? Hey. Hey, fella. How you gonna mess with the lumpy face retarded kid, man? Come on, bro. What? Okay. 
Bye. That's not right. Oh. Hey, what's eating you? Grown ups. Yeah, grown ups suck. Why do they get to make all the rules? I know it seems unfair, but hey, there ain't no rules in a tickle fight. Yes, <laughs> That's not okay. <laughs> Jimmy, there you are. Who the f are you? Get away from our son. But Mr. Barrington told me to. Who's Mr. Barrington? From the club. What club? You're in a lot of trouble, mister. Yeah. Are you sure about this, Peter? I mean, I know Stewie was disappointed about the carnival, but he'll get over it. He's a happy, resilient baby. I don't know, Lois. I feel like if we don't do something, Stewie's first words are going to be, why did you kill Christmas? And I want the carnival back, oh. too. You know, I know I'm usually what? all business, but deep down, what? you know what the thing is that keeps me going more than anything else? Wonder. A sense of wonder. Well, you have your work Yo! cut out for you, Peter. My father's always hated Christmas. Just think you could just borrow a bunch of money from a loan shark and then waste it on tacky suits? Tacky? Sir, I'll have you know I bought this in the lobby of a casino. Look, don't shoot. You must have us confused with somebody else. Sounds like somebody wants to die. Yeah, no, no. So, Stewie, just give him the money from the backpack. Okay, okay, don't shoot. What? It's empty. It's just Cheerios and coloring books. What? Where the hell's the money? Sir, we can't give you any money, but if you've got some milk and a bowl, we can give you a pretty healthy way to start your day. I say, Brian, this backpack feels a bit lighter than it did before. Well, I wasn't going to tell you till later, but I actually used part of my portion to take care of some personal business. All right, fine. Uh, oh. Oh. Peter, I don't think we need a donkey for this climb. Of course we don't need a donkey, Lois. It's a status thing here. You, Leatherman, you sell me donkey. What's the best one for sex? For him, not for me. I don't know what it is, but you have got it. We have to chase her through a series of shots where she has an inconsistent lead on us. You guys wrap this up. I see Peter coming with some kind of problem from the game. Quagmire, we agreed, and it was a two-hand touch, and then Chris hit me with one hand, and I said that didn't count, but he still wouldn't count the touchdown. So I drilled him in the head with the ball, and now he's not moving. He can blink his eyes, but nothing else. So is my dog still your dad? Uh, no. Chris, he said the touchdown counts. <laughs> Ah! Dr. Hartman, something's wrong with me. Everyone's treating me like I'm abroad. I don't know what's going on. I recognize that hysterical tone of voice. Sounds like someone's having their monthly. Yeah, get away from me, you creep! <gasps> my God, there was nothing wrong with my mirror. Everyone sees me as a woman. From now on, I'm going to do things differently. Men are jerks. Let's swear off of them and find comfort in each other. Give me yep. here, you guys. Yep. Yeah. That's how we do it. If I was a female, I would use the fact that I was a female to get other females. Nigga. <laughs> it's the only way. Be talking really fast. He spits whenever he makes the ch noise, which in this language happens a lot. I'm ex <laughs> uh, get out of there. Now be quiet. Quiet. Ah, I like them working together. <laughs> ah, 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 that was really close. Ah, wow. The price per square hey, foot is quite yeah. competitive with similar homes in the area. Yes, I also love it. I will likely purchase it unless others put in a rival bid. Well, what's stopping you? 
You know, you've always been so non-committal in our relationship. Do you know how much it hurt my feelings when you paused before introducing me to your parents? And it's the same reason you didn't take that job in Denver. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to waste your time. I just remembered my husband is a total chicken I'm not 100% sure what we're doing anymore. I have a credit card. All right. A lot of cool people on this route. Peter, give me the credit card. How'd you find out? The UPS guy from earlier? Sorry, Peter. New rule. I, I have to report any adults bragging about having a credit card. But, but you said I was cool. Did you even mean it? Nope. Nope. Did you even mean it? Nope. The real reason I ran over here is because I wanted to do this. There's yep. my little Lois. What? Lois? Brave men in desperate times when you gotta make out with your own mom. How damn almighty were those desperate times. Oh my god, Stewie, what happened? None of your business what happened! Jeez, you kiss your mother with that mouth? <laughs> Hired the finest builder in Greece to make us a giant wooden horse. We'll hide inside it. They'll take it in as a gift. And then we spring out and destroy the city. Well, that sounds great, but there's another door right here that's just beads. What? Yeah, just beads. See? Oh boy, this... this is gonna be a difficult phone call. Let's go, let's go! This needs to be done yesterday. Hello, Giant Horse Company, pay on delivery, no deposit required. Can I help you? Oh. Uh -huh. What? Chris, I see in the paper that Vietnam is still going on, and as a blue-collar TV dad, I demand you enlist. Peter, you can't send Chris to Vietnam. They're bombing women and children. You have no idea how bad it is over there. I don't. Oh, I know war, my friend. I stormed the beaches at Normandy. Ah! Of course, it was 1958, so the resistance wasn't quite as stiff. No running! I said no running! I'm not running! Once a griffin hits puberty, they turn into a full-blown bozo. Bozo the clown? Yes, of course, bozo the clown. What other bozos are there? I don't know, bozo the tax accountant? Well, the good news is, since you do a sex advice podcast, which I really like, by the way, every time you... <coughs> it's a write-off. Really? Oh, yeah. And not just... <coughs> also... And even... Are you kidding me? Do I look like I'm kidding? I want to watch my show! Oh, you don't like smell, huh? Well, sniff on this! Ah! Ah, my mouth is open! It's like a burning tire dump right in my nose! Oh. one of Rupert's eyes off. No, why would I do that? Maybe your turtle did it. Nonsense. Sheldon is a gentle soul. He wouldn't hurt anybody. Well, come on, let's get downstairs. Lois will be here any minute. in your bowl where you belong. Sheldon? Oh. <gasps> Come on, Stewie. He's just a little turtle. Well, 
well. Look who has surfaced. You're getting colder. Why is this so interesting? Yeah, turn up on him. Yeah, his. Oh my God. Ah! Hit him with the cocaine. Now batting, Stewie Griffin. Oh, crap. You know, Stewie, this is actually a good park. I've found a lot of old tennis balls here. Well, I don't care for this place. Last time I was here, I accidentally walked into a Spanish picnic. <laughs> Excuse me, has anyone seen a toy car around here? Ooh, it's baby. I make beautiful. Don't get any ideas about Julio. I'm his number one. Jack? 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 Jack. What is that other word? Thanks, Grandpa. This Christmas is perfect, isn't it, Mom? Almost, Meg. Almost. Yeah, it is. Except every time Grandpa bends over to get a present, his robe opens up. Let's see, I think this is for Chris. Good God! Here's one for Meg. And here's one for Stewie. Ah! Here's one for my beautiful daughter. Sweetie, come help me with this. So, Dad, are you excited for your first day of working from home? Yes, but I'm very late. Busy, Dad. Morning goodbyes. Forgot my phone. It'll be easy as one, two... Won't you die? Who did he shoot? Quagmire? Ah! Oh, hell no. Nope. I did not see that coming. Oh. <laughs> Is that the Epicac bottle? Oh, no. No, please, not this. Oh, God. It's not going to be coming out of us. It's going to be going... <laughs> oh, dear God. <laughs> oh. Oh. Ow! I don't want it. I don't want it. <laughs> Dad, I'm scared. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, this is so disgusting! I think I'm gonna puke! Oh. You know what I want for Christmas? I want my friend back. Your friend? Yes, my best friend. My dog, Brian. He's dead. I don't care about anything except Brian. I want Brian! <laughs> you want me to put a dead dog under your tree? <laughs> yes! <laughs> and uh, I'd l I'd like a bike too. Hi, is uh, is Peter Griffin here? What's going on? Who's this supermodel? I'm Katie. I'm your daughter. Ah, I guess I guess I just didn't expect this so soon. Well, we were all pretty excited to meet you. What do you mean we? Hi, Dad. We're all your children. 
Oh my god, that's so funny. I know I've been trying to figure out something we can do together, and I think I've found it. We're gonna sing a song. Now I'll start, and when I point to you, you'll sing your part. Ready? War! Uh. Yeah! What is it good for? Absolutely nothing! Okay, alright, good job. Now let's try something else. I wanna get you home and uh. double up. Uh. Uh. Okay, I like where ah. this is going. Let's take it from the top. I like big butts, and I cannot lie. Maybe oh my god. Cool. Fish bump. Ah, crap. Ah. Oh my god, Peter. Should I shoot him, make it go quicker? Yeah. I'm gonna fly home. Oh crap, Canadian goose. Look. Ah. 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 Oh, damn it. Ah. 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 Oh my god, ah. that looks so painful. Ah. Ah. I think I'm okay. Ah, Nichols. <laughs> Ah! Ah! Hold it, hold it. What's Nichols. going on? We're here to demolish this building by order of the bank. Like hell you are. Well, what are you talking about, Peter? We ain't going nowhere. This bar belongs to us. <gasps> ice cream truck. You didn't get any ice cream? The ice cream man was handsome. I got nervous. Do that. Yeah. Hey. Hey, looks like a fun party. Um, hey, listen, it's two in the morning. I'm guessing there's some kind of soccer match from your home country going on, and I get that. I do. But uh, some of us are trying to sleep. And I could almost deal with the noise, but it's the cologne. All right, I can smell it in my bed, and I live two houses from here. That's how powerful it is. Okay, that's how powerful it is. You like it? Yeah, I kind of like it. Yeah, I gotta take this. Who's calling? My ex-girlfriend. She calls me drunk every Valentine's Day. Hey, Samantha. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. I still love Lois. Eight city tour? What, I don't know if I can make eight, but I can certainly do six. What about Lois? She's totally out of the picture. We've done everything but sign the papers. Samantha, Samantha, I will see you in Binghamton. Jeez, what's not clear about Get Lost? By the way, my attendance at home is going to be spotty over the next few weeks. I want to watch my show! I gotta say... I gotta say, cats are so much better than dogs. Well, that's kind of a broad statement. It's true. Okay, show me one way in which cats are better than dogs. Well, okay. Uh, for one thing, they always land on their feet. Watch. Here, go ahead. Do what you just did, but with me. Oh! Oh, my God! Oh! My neck! Oh! Don't touch me! Call somebody! Oh! Oh! Hey, what's going on? I just figured out why cats are better than babies. Well, that's kind of a broad statement. Clear! No, you do stuff up here! Clear! 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 No, that's the good sound. Oh, well, why don't you just do everything? <laughs> Hate this stupid hospital. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, it'll be fun. <laughs> Isn't this great, Meg? Sorry I forgot to get you an ostrich. Hi, I'd like to return this keyboard. Was there something wrong with it? Well, it said it was designed for writers, but when I sat down to work, it just it wasn't flowing through me. Do you have a receipt? Uh, no. Can't you just look it up? Do you have the credit card you used to pay for it? I actually paid using store credit for another return. Do you have the original packaging for the item? <laughs> no, no, that's that's probably with the receipt. Better check on my hairless twin in the storm shed.
It's almost Christmas. It's almost Christmas. Christmas? Yes. Keep being good, and all the eggshells and coffee grounds will be yours. Can I meet the family? You've overstepped. No Christmas. <laughs> oh, no. My hairless twin got out. Hello, family. Let's eat all the garbage we want. It's just a terrible situation. Like when you're the only one at the table where the waiter doesn't say good order. I'll have the halibut? Ah, great choice. One of the chef's specialties. You'll love it. It was caught fresh less than 10 miles from here. I'll have the New York strip steak. Mmm, my absolute favorite dish here. It is a spectacular cut, superbly seasoned, and the marbling is some of the best I've ever seen. And I'll have the chicken. Mm-hmm. How you do that? What happened with you and those three little pigs? Why, why did you want to eat them so badly? It, it's so amazing that that's what people think happened. First of all, I didn't want to eat them, all right? I wanted to talk to one of them. About what? Well, she was my ex-girlfriend, and I believed I was due an explanation. All right, well, I'm off to my grandmother's. But before I go, I better take a deep woods dump. Her bathroom is right off the dining room, so it's either now or three days from now. I don't like eggnog. Drink the nog, Carter. I don't... I don't want to. Take it, Carter. Take all the nog. Yep. There you go. <coughs> yep. No! Yep. Yeah, you like that nog. Don't spit the nog out. Yep. Now look at the camera for a POV shot. Say thank you with the nog ah! in your mouth. Thank you. Louder! Ah! Thank you! Good. Now go down to the hotel lobby and yeah. check out with nog all over your face. All yeah. right. Yeah, you know, yeah. I kind of like what we just did. And so, whoever fits in this slipper will be my princess. Or prince. I'm by. Oh, there's my slipper. Oh, I've been looking all over for it. Well, when I'm not doing gymnastics. This could be your life. What? Enough! <gasps> I can't wait to make love to you a hundred years before the invention of toilet paper. Yep. Meow. We would all do this. Yeah. Oh my god. I think you're dreaming. No, oh my god. I'm not. Hmm? Hey, do you have the address? I think it's in my pocket book somewhere. Because I gotta know if we should take 24 or 495. Hang on. Oh, you'd think I could find it. Yeah, yeah, I would. I would. Okay, I'm taking 495. Here it is. It says take 24 to 128. Okay, we still got nothing to eat, so it looks like we're going to have to hunt animals for food. And since we have no weapons, I set up some traps and snares. Well, I was about to take a leak. Can I go in that direction? Yes. Ah! No. Ah, damn it, my legs! I think they're oh. broken! Yay, Joe, now you have a friend. <laughs> damn it, Peter, this is all your fault. Listen, uh -oh. I wish you had a family to take care of you, too, but that's a choice you made. Oh! This is a robbery! Everybody get on the ground! If this nope. moves, shoot him in the eye! Nope. Dad! There's no time to argue. We got 150 seconds before the police respond to the silent alarm. Now check those bags for die packs. <laughs> Who's the manager here? I, I am. <laughs> what are you doing? You said if he moves, shoot him! He's the only one with the combination that is safe! It's blown! It's blown! This whole operation is blown! I'll get the car. Kill everyone else. Oh! You realize that until 1928, there were no hoses, and you actually had to fight fires with your bare hands. I will now give a demonstration. Well, there it is. Whoa, scrappy little blaze, huh? Oh my god, the fire's got a gun! 
Yep. Oh my god. What the f was that? There's no other way. Okay, I'm back. Why are you still wearing that unitard? Well, here, let me help you get it off. No, 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 I pooped. I pooped. Well, that's good. I haven't seen you at the clam. Well, I've been pretty busy. So, can I get you something to drink? Sure, what do you got? Well, I've got water with cat hair in it. Eh, uh, anything else? I've got lemonade with cat hair in it. Uh, can I have a summer drink? Anything else? Oh, sure. Cat hair ginger ale? Nope. Cat hair iced tea? Uh, again, summer. You want to just take a look in the fridge, see what I got? Sure. Someone just had kittens in my mouth. Oh, my God. How yeah. do you know what's inside you unless you test yourself? Don't do one push-up. Do 100. Don't run one mile. Run a marathon. Don't have one family. Have a second family all the way across the country. Don't just have a second family. Have a third family in Santa Fe with an alternative lifestyle. Well, you see, I recently completed construction on a teleportation device. Oh, Stewie, that's incredible. So, what do you say? Let's do it. Okay, now the device is powered by kinetic energy, so you've got to dance to make it work. You, uh, w really? Yeah, you've got to dance. <laughs> what? What are you doing, you tool? Do you know anything about science? You just saw me program it. Ah, what happened to your eye? Don't worry about it. Just put the lens in. But where do I put it? The pupil's gone. Your eye just looks like a ping pong ball. I think it rolled up into my head. Look, just, just do the other one. Ah! Where are you? I can't see anything! Ah! 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 I don't like this. Just wear your stupid glasses. Chris, I'm blind! I'm sorry, Meg! <laughs> oh. We now return to Ellen only talks when her guest is talking. Oh. So you want to hear about my movie? Uh, I had a great, we spent great weekend three months this weekend. Shooting I, in I danced all over and, uh, you know, my house. A thriller, I, I, I tried to really dance in every room at least once too. a week. I, I also listen to jazz while I vacuum, which is cool. She anyway, really do that. Friday, and I got to work with Juliana Margulies. I, I think there's like something in the nicer. air, like smog or pollen or po pollinated smog. Or... Are you just gonna talk over everything? I love that talking I say? on TV. I'll do, I'll do anything to talk on TV. Previously on NCIS. Ah, son of a bitch! Oh my God! What kind of Navy crime do we have today? I almost yeah, hit myself yeah. in the ball. I'll show you. Follow me to our windowless high-tech room. I love you, Peter. Drive the van faster. <laughs> He's headed towards the port of Washington, D.C., where our Navy is What's headed. What's up, I'm brown yeah. around. See you on the other side. Oh, my God. We now return to Girlfriends Ooh. on Lifetime. Barry was over last night, and Ooh, don't tell hot. me. He, he left, left the toilet seat up. <laughs> oh, I ran into Frank. It's funny. He fought in Vietnam. He's an exorcist. But there is one thing that terrifies him. Commitment. Commitment. <laughs> And now, back to Two and a Half Men. Oh! 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 We now return to Sesame Street, now on HBO. Yo. return. Damn it! We knew there would be injuries. Ah! Uh, can't ruin my feet, man. I'll mess around and ruin my only toes. Turn to Home Alone with competent robbers. Hey, be careful. There's cars on the floor here. Thanks. That's weird, huh? Yeah, the doorknob was really hot, but I just let go instead of holding on to it. And there's some ice on the stairs to the basement, so I guess just don't go down there. Just so you guys know, I have a tarantula. Oh! Well, now there are no witnesses. Now return to Michael McDonald during allergy season. <gasps> what? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's funny.
Turn to the Cosby Show. Yep. Knowing what we know now. Yep, here it is. Oh! 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 <laughs> yep, there she is. Hey, she's just happy to be getting laid. Yep. Hey, everyone's had sex with that bird. That bird is a whore. Everyone, everyone has been inside of that bird. I was so busy not seeing color, I didn't see the raping either. Yep. That's what happened with me, man. That's why I didn't notice the raping. We now return to Ethiopian hoarders. This is racist. <laughs> I don't know how it got like. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> what? We now return to Star Trek Creep Space Nine. Creep Space Nine. What? You can see that from out the window? Ah, she saw us. Warp speed. Move, please. You're blocking the screen. We now return to Damn Nature, You're Scary yep. on BET. Damn, that motherfucker run fast. You see that shit? Hmm? That thing come by my house, I kill it. <laughs> that little rat looking thing just got ate. Damn, Nature, you scary. Now return to Game of Thrones on BET. Oh. I got a big ass coat, chair to sit in, chowder's cup of wine, and a bitch. But I ain't going out there with all them monsters out there. We now return to the extended director's cut of Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Charlie, don't forget what happened to the boy who got everything he ever wanted. What? He lived happily ever after. But he did have to earn it. Yep. Hint, hint. Yep. Do it, Charlie! I'm not going back to that four-person bed! Hell See, this is why it's important to work hard and get money, guys. Because then you can give this same speech to some unsuspecting female that just started college. So she's broke. Yeah, baby, you got every. She got everything she wanted, you know. But she did have to earn it. I had to suck on something. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I'll Hint. Do it, Charlie. I'm not going back to that four-person bed. Hell, I'll do it if you want. No, it has to be a child. <laughs> what did he just say? Return to oh. Japanese girls think small versions of things are really cute. Oh, look at my tiny dog. I'm gonna put it in my tiny purse. <laughs> tiny phone. <laughs> Return to the Scooby-Doo murder files. Gee whiz, gang. Looks like the killer gutted the victim, strangled him with his own intestines, and then dumped the body in the river. Jinkies, what a mystery. <laughs> You're right, Scoob. We're dealing with one sick son of a bitch. <laughs> we now return to an 80s teen movie at a realistic high school. You going down at that karate tournament. I don't think so. You guys do karate? Oh. Uh -huh. Losers. Oh. Touched by an angel, is that sexual? We now return to touched by an angel. In a sexy now, way? Where exactly did the angel touch you? Oh no. Here? Oh, come on. Who are you gonna believe? I got a freaking halo. Shh, shh. Uh -huh. We now return to Brian Cranston sneezes. <laughs> Thank you. Oh! Hey, if you got it, you got we it. We now return to Hard Knocks CFL, training camp with the Toronto Argonauts. I hope you make it. You're real good. No way, not as good as you. I hope you make it. What are you going to do with all your money? Oh, probably just save it. Yeah, that's real smart. Well, back to my book. We now return to Muppet Babies. Uh, Piggy, I don't think Kermie Jr. is doing so well. Kill me! <laughs> constant pain! Hmm. We now return to Breaking Bad. What? You will recommend Breaking Bad to everyone you know. I will recommend Breaking Bad to everyone I know. Breaking Bad is the best show you've ever seen, except maybe The Wire. Breaking yes. Bad is the best show I've ever seen, except maybe The Wire. You will never stop talking about Breaking Bad or The Wire. I will never stop talking about Breaking Bad or The Wire. Oh, we're slowing down. That's a good sign. You know what's not slowing down? Breaking Bad. Haven't yeah. seen anything like it since The Wire. God, he never shuts up about those shows. We now return to Superman. <laughs> Lois, what's wrong? Clark, we all have breast cancer. The doctor says it's as if our breasts have been x-rayed five hours a day, every day for the last three years. Oh my God, that's terrible. First every woman I've ever known, and now you guys. 
Now return to Wizard Robot and his less successful friend. What the hell is Wizard uh, Robot? We're in a real jar of jam this time, Wizard Robot. What? Yep, gulp. I have put too much suds in this machine for washing clothes. And tonight is the night I meet with other members of my Form 12 learning mates to celebrate the exactly two groupings of ten years ago. Deep gulp. What the hell is Gleep Glop? Oh, excellent. The situation has abated itself. Let us leave the room where no comedic situation will soon take place. <laughs> That don't even make no sense. Oh! And his less successful friend? That's racist. You better take me as I am, god damn it! Fred heard it from Tom Tucker. Tucker heard it from Bender on Futurama, oddly enough for some reason. Bender heard it from Al Harrington. Harrington from REO Speedwagon. You wanna watch SpongeBob? Yes. With apple juice. That's racist. SpongeBob. Hi, oh. Cleveland. Go back to Cohog. Okay. Huh, what a drive. Thirteen hours is a long way with only one hand on the wheel. Oh. Ha. Huh. Got our old Peter back. But I kind of miss Meg. Oh, yeah, that's right. She got traded to American Dad. I hear she's doing great. Good morning, USA. ba da ba da ba stands the dad and the alien's gay. And then there's a fish and a boy and a girl. Hey! Shut up, Meg. Oh, so it's just going to be the same? Yep. Yeah. What a day. Tell me about it. I don't even know where the hell I am. Looter! Oh! Pants. Oh! I'm making a white talking as if it's normal. Oh! Peter, what are you doing? You know me! Everybody shut up and let me think. Just let me think! Oh! Stan, have you... <laughs> Yo! <laughs> oh, man. Classic American dad. What? It was awfully nice of our new neighbors to invite us over for dinner. I don't know, Lois. Going to Cleveland's house with someone else living there just seems weird. Like when a new pope moves into the Vatican. Hello, neighbors. Joe, you can walk. How do you do? I'm Stan Smith. Please, come in. I need $50. They're selling a biopsy of Celine Dion's uterus on eBay. The hell kind of dog is that? <laughs> I was going to ask the same thing. Oh. Hey, hey, let's just all be grateful that things are completely back to normal again. Who ate all the pecan sandies? So, says here you're involved in the plotting of September 11th? Well, that's what they get for supporting Israel. Oh. Yuck, 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 gosh. Okay, into the eternal pit of fire you go. Oh. <laughs> hey, so much fun it should be illegal. By copyright <laughs> infringement. <laughs> oh, see you at the game, Joel. Oh. There we go, Brian. <laughs> see you at Disneyland. Bring money. What the hell? What's happened to us? I don't know, but suddenly I feel all sweet and warm and fuzzy. It seems we're in a universe where everything is drawn by Disney. You said we were going to a place Walt Disney built. No, Peter, I said supported. By the way, don't go on the train ride. Comrade Mouskowitz, did you think you could run forever? Hiya, I think you've got the wrong mouse. I'm just regular old Frank Maxwell, and I'm very late for work. Good day, ma'am. You killed him? That was not me. Someone else got to him first. Tough break, Jew Mouse! Oh! Uh -huh. Jew Every Mouse? Every time we go to Disney World, he thinks Mickey Mouse just happened to be there that day. I'll tell you, seeing God in heaven was just like that time I met Mickey and Donald outside Thunder Mountain. I mean, what are the odds? Mickey Rabbit, Sponge Cow, and Clifton, the small blue dog. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go put on my Donald Duck costume. Ready! Armando, do you have the rent? We are trying, Senor Griffin, but the land, she gives us nothing. There is no sunlight.
It's been two months, Armando. You're putting me in a real awkward position here. Oh, please, Senor Griffin. Just one more week. I will pay you double. Perhaps we can work out another arrangement. Oh, please, Senor. Not my beloved. Nope. Armando, Armando. It is for the children. Nope. Oh. Yeah, yeah, girl. Yep. <laughs> nope. Yes. Yeah. 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 Nope. Number one. Number two. Um... Number one, number two. What's wrong with your father? Um, about the same. Number one might be a tiny bit better. Number three, number four. Number three. Five and six. Uh, five and six. Uh, about the same? Yeah, they're pretty much... Can I see five one more time? Five. And six. Yeah, they're about the same. Uh, by the way, uh, Pinocchio, uh, there was a cookie missing from the jar. Did you, uh, did you take it by any chance? Yes, Papa Gibetto. No. I'm sorry. Always butt stuff. Oh, if only I had a pair of legs. All right. Sir, I think you should know these growths on your forearms. They're giant tumors. Oh, uh -huh. oh dear. Yeah, I'm surprised you haven't realized this is not how a human being is supposed to look. And the speech thing and what you're doing with your eye? Uh, you had a stroke about seven years ago. Uh -huh. That you've managed to be walking around all this time is nothing short of a miracle. I'd say about two months. You want to be a star, don't you? And take it off! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's nice. <laughs> Uh, that Starting now. I just bought a giant room full of gold coins and I'm gonna dive into it like Scrooge McDuck. Don't you do it. No. Don't you do it. Oh, oh, it's no. not a liquid. It's no. a great many pieces of solid matter that oh. form a hard floor like oh, surface. Ah! Oh. Well, I'll tell you this, Peter. You ain't never had a friend like me. It's disgusting. It smells, it's falling apart. You can hear the mice humping in the wall. What? That was so awesome. At least it wasn't Goofy's voice that came from out of that room. <laughs> Thank you. That would have been terrifying. What is that? This is my magic eight ball. This is the first black ball that Kim Kardashian hasn't played with. We now oh. return to Jeremy Piven as the Incredible Hulk. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. I don't like you now. Oh! Jeez, oh, I'll read 1984. You better, because this was more embarrassing than when we played Truth or Dare with present-day Madonna. Uh, oh, my God. Truth. Do I look younger than 90? Dear. This is Pitbull's house. He knows everything about South Florida. He can help us find Mort. Doorbell, 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 ring. <laughs> it's my house. It's mi casa. Wow. Imagine kind of knowing two languages. Uh. Just need a little help. Just like how Sylvester Stallone needs help getting ready in the morning. So what are we thinking this morning? Uh, you know, I'm like a big face, big fat face, with a goatee with a little tiny eyes. Okay. And what about for your body? Yeah, you know, veins, all kinds of veins everywhere, like little, little rivers everywhere. Oh, I guess you learn something new every day, like the Black Eyed Peas. Hey, what's that? This is a guitar. Wow. Because you're beautiful, Meg. Thanks to you. Come on, let me introduce you to the president. He's kind of like my boyfriend. Word? Uh, hang on, he's still getting ready. Oh! Oh! Steven Seagal. Oh, no. Uh, uh, th it, this, this fat guy? Yep. Uh. Go on, ask him anything. I, how did, uh, why, why are you so fat? Okay, uh. ask him about anything but his weight. Uh, uh, you act Asian, you look Native American, your name is possibly Jewish. What are you? Hey, fat.
I don't have what? a housekeeper, and I think you're just present-day Arnold Schwarzenegger. No, I am a machine. Every second I'm not having sex with a housekeeper. Robots are killing people in the future. Yep. Okay, I finished for the day. You lied to me. You do have a housekeeper. Let's go make a large-faced boy. My God, I'm not going to die. What do you mean? Of course you are. I'm not going to die, Brian. I'm like Jim Belushi. I am worried about my funny brother, though. Food fight! <laughs> this is tragic, but will also open a door for me. We now return to Extreme Makeover, Bethany Frankel edition. Move that bus! No. Put that Put the bus, bus back. back. Bring it back. Bring it back. <laughs> That was my pleasure, too, Peter. Hey, I knew I'd get you. Just like Danny DeVito got Rhea Perlman. I don't know, Danny. Look, it's either me or nobody. Sold. Really? Ah! Are you sure? Oh, yeah, this is nothing. I've been in uncomfortable situations before. Like whenever I meet famous people. Hey, what's up? I'm Snoop Dogg. Know what I'm saying? I do! But you don't, Peter. You don't. We're looking for a friend who's hiding out down here. He's a Jewish pharmacist from Rhode Island. Coropal Motel. Told you. And here's Pitbull with his newest hit, Tink Ta Tonka Ti Tong Tong Tink. Adios, goodbye, amigo friends. I gotta go get paid to scream, make some noise, in Vegas. Oh, yeah. Peanut butter cup, Dorito sausage, car panini. And let's uh, crack a Cadbury egg over the whole thing. No. I'm just going to use my spare glove compartment underwear as a napkin. No. I can't believe Randy Quaid gets to eat like this every day. He's Brian. That's more ridiculous what? than the theory of why Tom Cruise runs in all his movies. Wow, that cameraman has nice, strong arms. You can't catch me, gay thoughts. Oh, you're a worse parent than Britney Spears. I know, I know. Oh. The gift basket was not worth the trip, not by a long shot. Oh. Oh, I gotta get that. I'll talk to you later. God, that must be where they do the deed. I hope it's at least peaceful and humane. Magic. Oh. Oh boy. Magic eight ball is the first. I gonna do Michael Vick like that in this new streaming world. No! No! <gasps> Kim, what's wrong? A black ball went to waste. No. Lois? Where the devil is everyone? This place is more deserted than James Gandolfini's workout room. Miss Lohan! Lindsay! Over here, Lindsay! Excuse me, which one was Lindsay Lohan's dessert? You gotta for? smell her seat. Uh, I think it was that one. You gotta smell her chair. Give me cocaine! I said nah, smell her chair. In fact, I see Stewie reading a book. Scratch and sniff. Lindsay Lohan goes jogging. Oh, God, that's terrible. Oh, oh here's a pop up book. Tommy Lee goes boating. What else did I have to do today? Ah, yes, overdose in my apartment. I oh! Oh! Now return to yet another Indiana Jones movie. Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? Elderly potheads. Why did it have to be elderly potheads? Ludacris, that's not Tyrese. What are you talking about? They look nothing alike. Ludacris looks like a human peanut, and Tyrese looks slick. He looks like a Chinese black. Like Africa and Asia had sex while Europe sat on a chair in the corner of the hotel room and watched. Ludicrous human peanut. Tyrese, Chinese black. It's gonna be crazier than whatever Kanye West is doing at this particular moment. I'm giving this lasagna a massage while preparing to announce I'm joining ISIS. Thank you for your interest. Don't forget, I was in that elevator with Jay-Z. Oh, hey, that's gonna leave a mark. <laughs> that's from a movie. So are you girls traveling with your dad here? No. Hey, don't kick no. him, muddy shoes. He's got Beat a white him. suit on. Hey, look, I don't know if you guys are really staying here, but you can't get into the pool without a room key. Well, I know a thing or two about performing. I mean, after all, I was Vin Diesel's acting coach. Okay, Vin, I like what you do in there, but I want you to try it one more time like this. Duh! We now return to Joni Loves Chris Brown. Oh! Joni, Chris, welcome to the party. Can I offer you some punch? No, thanks. I had some in the car. 
Johnny Lewis Chris Brown was taped in front of a very uncomfortable studio audience. Hey, Chris Brown, I just wanted to say I'm a huge fan of your music. Oh. This is just gonna make me listen more. Oh, hey, Ray Rice, would you mind pressing lobby? What do you got, potatoes in your ears? I said press lobby. This is great, Dad. I know, I'm having even more fun than when I, I mean, than when we went Fiona apple picking. Dad, they're all bruised and filthy. Yeah, these might be throwing at Bus's apples, not eating apples. Excuse me, Mr. Cobain? Look, I know you're depressed, made some bad choices with women, but there's another way. Hagen does. Lots of Hagen does. <laughs> yeah, let's see if it worked. Here we go. Ha! You're still alive, you fat. I haven't seen this much denial since John Travolta married Kelly Preston. John, do you take Kelly to be your wife? I totally do. I mean, yeah, yes, absolutely. And I I'm gonna do stuff to her too, like uh, touch her. Yeah, touch her and uh, kiss her and touch her penis. I mean, no, not that. Not wow, it looks like Michael Jackson's coming right at me. A hurricane? Oh, my God, Peter's out there. Don't worry, Lois. Peter's good at getting out of trouble, just like Kobe Bryant. We want the truth, Kobe. Did you rape her? Ooh. What were we talking about? Hey, some of our greatest actors started in news, like Sean Penn. Today's weather calls for, uh... Breezy skies and sun, and there's gonna be a. Get that camera out of my face! Oh, oh, we, we gotta get you to the hospital. Oh, oh, you're hideous. Who did this to you? Oh, oh, where are my keys? Where's my keys? Where are my keys? Peter, what about Babs? Forget about yourself for a second, Carter. Look what has happened to Jonathan Lipnicki. Oh, was yeah. he uglier before no, this? You're, you're, you're right. You should probably take care of that. Was he less the ugly? George Clooney, there is. Hi, George Clooney, second worst Batman. Peter Griffin, second best Homer. You may have heard, I'm also known for my practical jokes on the set. One time, I nailed Nora Dunn in the head with an apple. <laughs> that, that's hilarious, because you're handsome. Otherwise, you're just some dick who hit a lady. Yep. And you, you're done. Clean out your locker. Kicked out? I'm totally screwed. Like those poor guys who had to come up with a new ad campaign for Subway. Hey, I'm Mike. I like sandwiches and people my own age. Subway, please don't think of pedophilia. There's a lesson you need to learn. What are you talking about? What lesson? I don't need to go to AA. I'm a social drinker, not an alcoholic. Tuh, yeah, that's like saying rappers are really poets. Oh, aren't they? I'm not saying she's a gold digger. Hey, that's real. But she's not messing with... No, bro. Who and... isn't she messing with? Their, I know their name starts Shouldn't with... have tried these tricks on Denise Bryan, but if you ask me, she got lucky. Because now she's dodged the bullet of being in a relationship with a loser like you. That's Boy, racist. you just think you know everything, don't you? You're like a black woman in hindsight. Oh, no. I told you. That's... What did I tell you? Didn't I tell you? Because I told you. Mm-hmm. And when did I tell you? A long time ago. And what did I say will happen no. when I told you? Exactly what just happened. I can't stand them bitches. Mr. Pewdishman, you're having an affair? Ew! No, no, this is my sister. Ew! Oh, no, no, I I'm impotent. Ew! Ugh. I mean, she looked at me while I did it to myself. Ew! Ew. I mean, she's a man. Ew! Ew. Ew. Oh. We need more E's and W's down here now! We're trying! We're running out of letters! Just turn the M's upside down and send them down here! You so can't just do that! There's a lot of paperwork before you I do don't care! I'll take the heat! Just turn them over and send them down! Yeah. And remember, wish it, want it, buy it. All right. Brian, settle down. You're no worse dudes, than that guy man. from Penguin Publishing. You, you want to get no a dudes, book published, man. don't you? Well, yes. Well, if you want to be in black and white, black and white's got to be in you. Oh, boy. Yep. Somebody said I said that. <laughs> Do you have any experience helping out people with special needs? Well, I did work for that old lady down the street. Is she naked? Meg, could you come here, please? Can the old lady be naked? What is it? Could you see if I'm getting a bed sore it's a on fat my back? Man. Sure. It's a fat man. Even I can't bone Looks that. fine to me, ma'am. Yep. Thank you, dear. Looks I good. must have just slept on it wrong. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I stole Meg's cutaway. No, you're, you're ruining the joke. Just leave. Oh, my God. You look so cute. What is that? Spray paint? Yeah. Those little punks want a war, and now they've got one. Hey, here's someone who might understand how you feel. Hey. How you doing? First day being pink? 
Yeah. Hmm? Welcome to hell. How was that hell? What was the beat drop for? Meg, for God's sake, relax. You're not the first person to be outshined by a sibling. What about the third Bronte sister? That's racist. Oh, Emily, Wuthering Heights was truly splendid. Oh, no, Charlotte. Jane Eyre was so very brilliant. What's a Bronte? I may blood out my lady parts. Oh, no. Good for you. So we've all done something. It's happening now. God, Lord. Ah, it's a period joke. It's a period, period joke. Just accept <laughs> the mouth sex. Okay, moving on. Just accept the mouth sex. Next, I want you to fly to France and tell French people that a good-looking, depressed guy smoking a cigarette is not a movie. Isn't it? <clears throat> people of France, a good-looking, depressed guy smoking a cigarette is not a movie. And your sirens sound like gay guys having a threesome. God, Lord. I, I don't know why this gets me every time. Well, that's what I tried to tell you, but you were stubborn as a pigeon at an ad agency. There's a pigeon? Guys, 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 these are all good ideas, but I think what people really get excited about is dropped museum popcorn. But this is an ad campaign for a Nissan SUV. How does that possibly... Phil, Phil, <laughs> Phil, <laughs> Phil, I was put in charge of this meeting, and we're going with dropped museum popcorn. Or a movie theater. I got the drop Peter, the would you get in the damn bag? Every time. I'm going to have the best birthday party ever. I gave out all my invitations yesterday. Hey, Chris, Um, I was wondering if you'd like to come to my party tomorrow. Thanks, Dad. I'd love to. Yeah. Oh, no. M-E-G. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Uh, nothing? nothing. Sports. Birthday nothing. sports. No, just sports. No, oh. nothing. Okay. Nothing. Nothing at all. Megan, oh, not invited God. to my party. This is racist which is why it's gonna be funny. Oh my God, oh no. It was a bag of Tapatio Doritos, bro. I mean, the bag is already popped. I might as well go ahead and crush these. I gotta, yeah, I mean, let me, yep, yeah, this is a good idea. Just make, yep, mm-hmm, yeah. Round one. That is, you got it. Adrian, you, you got it, that's racist. You got it, you got it. It can't be anymore. Yo. That is. Yep, that's right. That's nasty. That's gay. I don't know what that was. That's, that's racist. That's racist. Yep. You lose. Yep. Here's some money for groceries and a list of the kids' schedules. The fat man in charge for a week? He's going to be in over his head like when he was a boxing coach. Punch, uh -oh. punch him again. Punch him. Punch him now. Again. Now you're getting yep. punched. Punch back. Don't let him hit you. Get out of the way. Punch him. Punch him in the balls like Johnny Cage. You know what I'm gonna tell you. They gotta punch. You him. gotta punch him more. Punch him in the balls. Look, if you want to grab a drink with me later tonight, I'd be happy to tell you some. Turn up! Oh my God, I would love to. Look at me, huh? Stepping out in the town with a big celebrity. Yeah, <laughs> well, buddy. I think you're exaggerating. No, you're a lady big shot, like Miss Piggy. Hey, Kermit, what happened to the bears in space sketch? Sorry, it's pigs in space now. There's been a change. What? There's been a change. Oh. But what about the old guy? I heard him complaining about woods in the dining room. That's true. He replaced my Cialis with methamphetamines. Pedal faster! I can't go what? any faster! Where you going, kids? Hey, Yo. I just want to talk to you. Why don't you come over to my place for a glass of wine and a couple of fruit oh. pies, and then we can go in the back room and play crazy snakes. Hee 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 Shout out, Meth. I, I can't believe it. That's the Shout worst thing meth. I've ever written. Not according to Penguin Publishing. In fact, you're supposed to call the chief editor. Penguin Publishing. One moment, please. Sir, I have a Brian oh. Griffin on the line. Out. Get out. Get out now. Ah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, what? You didn't think it was free, did you? <laughs> oh, I don't want to choke on this chip I'm eating. <laughs> Oh, that is good. You didn't see anything. Remember that. Or I'll ruin you. Okay, okay, oh. I promise. I'll be as quiet as a church mouse. Hey, Billy, I was going to have a party at the rectory this evening. Do you like sacramental wine and mouse Russell Crowe movies? Absolutely oh, not. Boy, do I? Hey, can my sister come? No, she'd ruin it. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, it's what kids do on Halloween. They, they dress up in costumes and they go around asking for candy. How do you not know about trick-or-treating? Well, how do you not know that your reflection in the patio door isn't another dog? Hey, that guy's a dick. Hey, get out of here. This is my house. Yep, there it is. Oh, my God, yep. Brian, what happened? Mess Who did up. this to you? Get him. Did you do this? Get you him. son of a bitch. 
Ah! Because ah! when you get there, ah! you may find out it isn't what you thought it was, and I wouldn't want you to be disappointed. That's it? That's your reason? But it's chips, well, you know, bro. You know why nothing works out for you, Brian? Because you've got a negative attitude. Really? Like Eeyore. Come on, oh. Eeyore. Let's go play. I don't feel like it. Why are you always in such a bad mood? I have a nail in my anus. Oh. Ah! Ah! Millions are saved. That's why I make sure to stay out of prison. I don't know from personal experience, but I can only imagine how unpleasant a nail in one's anus would be. Anything being shoved into anyone's exit only bat cave could have terrible, horrifying consequences. Thousands of years without AA. Just like they got along for thousands of years without religion. I like you and have no reason not to. I like you and have no reason not to. Hey, did you hear about that magic baby that was born in Bethlehem? <laughs> oh! Oh! Jesus! Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for our national anthem, performed this afternoon by Peter Griffin and his dirt bike. Peter got a dirt bike? Peter! What's he playing, Happy Wheels? Is this a Happy Wheels skit? Everybody in the audience is like dumb. The chips are really good. Chips are really good. <laughs> I hate your north side face. Oh, well. Lois, that's terrible. Yeah, my day was even worse. I got pegged by a new form of spitball. What? <laughs> What type of What type of Hey, get up, you faker. It's just a spitball. Oh. We now return to a later season episode of Family Ties. Elise, have you noticed how puberty has changed Jennifer? Shh. Keep your voice down. I have a date with my boyfriend. Oh, damn. Well, uh, have fun. You are to gather grapes for wine and prepare victuals for my return. She back, huh? Oh, still smash. As of today, I'm stepping down as mayor and leaving Quahog forever. Because still smash. Of Carol? That's right. I've decided to move to Alaska and become an Eskimo. Alaska? But that's so far away. And the summers are so short. Yay! Summer's here! Awesome! Best summer ever! Let's stay friends! That's I lost my virginity! Yeah, right. To who? You don't know her. I met her at camp. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, I took the liberty of replacing your old one with a new American-made coffee machine. In fact, I got you a bunch of new top-notch American-made stuff. I just wasted the chips all over the floor. Don't worry, there's still some left in the bag, but there's more on the floor that's in the bag. I'm gonna put some sheets of newspaper over it. That way I don't track it anywhere. Anything I gotta do to not have to clean it, yeah? What else did you buy? Oh, a couple things. That light fixture. Oh. New heat regulator on your stove. Oh. Your man bra. Oh. Your garbage disposal, uh. your dishwasher, Is that poop? and your new cat. Why are his titties so big? <laughs> oh, that's not even what This is my say. first Halloween, and, it, and, and it's ruined. <sighs> all right, all right, fine, we'll look for him. Good, because so far, Halloween's a bigger letdown than being a Mets fan. Opening day, and here's the first pitch, and the season's over. Oh. Sorry, I'm done. You want your kid to sit on my lap? Meet me at the bar at Applebee's. Oh! No! Oh, that sucks. Sorry, Stewie. That son of a bitch. He just turned his back on me. The way reality turned its back on Gary Busey. How am I doing today, Gary Busey? You're doing great. Good. Then I'll keep it up. Wow. That was so much fun to watch. What a pro you are. Lois, you've met Tom Tucker. Oh, yes, of course. I loved that piece you did on the invention of the guillotine. Oh, thank you. You know, half the time those things didn't really work. Really? How was it, honey? Oh. oh, they couldn't finish. Oh, really? Yeah, I gotta go back tomorrow. There's nothing worse than not being finished off when you're decapitated. Because you got that little bit left over, and now you gotta find someone else and set up a whole nother appointment to get the rest of uh, it. Because who's gonna, who's gonna have a, a spare axe to chop the rest of it off if that's what you need to cross the finish line? I gotta how, stop. How come we're the only animals with poo that's white? I know. What the hell? Right? We're not. We're not eating white stuff. That's hey, racist. you want something good? 
Just look for the containers that say KFC on them. Yeah, why can't there's the always be black? something good in there, dude? That's birds in there. Yep. You're, e- you're you're eating, eating another other bird. Birds. Other what? Birds. That's bird yep. meat, dude. Bird meat. What? Yep. No, you're yes. eating a bird. You're oh eating, my god. You're eating oh my one god. Of us. <laughs> yeah, cry all you want, man. Well, it's a lot easier than high school. I'll tell you that. Well, how do you mean? High school is like Lord of the Flies. It's a social nightmare. And I hear Canadian high schools are even worse. Well, what? well, look who matriculated to grade nine. Wow. Someone wants to get into university. <laughs> hey, guys, I'm sorry. Well, you're going to be sorry when we put you in the hospital for free, eh? What? Peter, I need That's you to not... pick up the dry cleaning. Here's the That's ticket. A it's a Chinese one over on Elm. All right, well, I need my other white shirt back anyway. This one's getting kind of smelly. And if I wore another color, I think it would just throw people. You only have two white shirts? Well, I had a third one, but it got ruined at that wine tasting at Michael J. Fox's house. Oh. I really like the finish on this charade. Oh. Son of oh. a bitch, what is your problem? Oh! Go down to the dock and find Daddy, and we'll get dinner started. You're not going to get dinner started. She's going to tell that sloppy old Spanish maid to do it. And she will, but only because she needs money to pay for medicine for her prematurely overweight son, Diabito. Oh, my piece. Mama, may I have cookie? Oh, no, right Diabito. Piece. Roll back to kitchen. Oh! oh. Now listen. Oh, man. That one was so hard, I gotta, I gotta check to make sure they're still there, right? One, two, three, four. Okay, we still good. Very closely, because here's how it's gonna go down. Oh! Oh! You better still shoot! There it is! Oh, that's not good. Uh-oh. Ooh! That works! That works. Guys, 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 I don't want to toot my own horn we did here, that. but I think that was me. That was it. Wow. Why was that over so quickly? You can't just end it that fast. Come on, man. I was, <laughs> I was vibing. All right. Yep. Let's do it. Yep. Both of you are under arrest for prostitution. Shit. It's not prostitution. You paid her to have sex. No, I paid her to have sex and we're filming it. Yep. So technically it's not prostitution. It's a porno. It's a porno. Oh. Well, as yep. long as you're filming and selling it, yep. it's legal. That's real. Enjoy your day. That's real. Remember, kids, she's not a whore if she's an actress. That's this real. This has been a message from yep. the Church of Jesus Christ of oh. Latter-day Saints. Oh. <laughs> oh. Peter, for God's sake, you're always an embarrassment oh. at the table. Oh. You should have seen him when we had dinner with Paul McCartney's ex-wife. Was there he porn kept involved? playing footsie with her under the table. Yeah, <laughs> feet stuff. Hey, make sure to subscribe <laughs> to the Only uh, Toes. <laughs> oh, my daily, God, I'm so sorry. Daily Feet Nudes. Now really I know how leg? Peter feels when Mort steals his paper. If I made an Only Toes, like, would you guys legit, like, buy it, though? Yeah, like, that's right. Yeah, I mean, bastard. Only Feet Stuff. Just. Stop feet. right there! Feet Stuff. Oh, feet. Yeah, give me the paper! No! No, oh, don't dang. hurt me, you bastard! Oh, feet. Mort, give what? me the paper! No, I'm reading it in here. Wow. You can have the real estate section. It's Homie for petty. schmucks anyway. Homie Petty. Oh, I feet. love hearing oh, about day. your process. Oh, hey, enough about time. me. This was a great meal. Oh, good, you good. Know? I'm glad you like it. They told me everybody comes here. For you guys. Hey, there's Renee Zellweger. Hey, Renee, how you doing? Ew, she ugly. Oh, hi, Brian. Ooh. Yep, she is shaped like an anteater. That, that is accurate. Lois? Terrifyingly Where accurate. Is my Red Bull? Peter, I got rid of it. Why the hell would you do that? It was making you crazy, and oh, it's not good legs. for you. That's why I poured it all out, oh, my God. The pain. The pain. I am at 23 minutes right now doing this uh, nunchuck challenge, man. Yep. I'll probably be the first person to ever actually Official do the flower challenges. business. So flower business? Is what you selling weed? Boo is he selling hoo. Himself? You don't like it? You can go talk to a reporter. Pee on oh her. Oh my god. Like R. Kelly. I thought we were friends. Yep, the kind thought. of really good friends that communicate with each other yep. poorly through Facebook. You thought, bitch. My Aunt Clara just passed away after a lengthy battle with cancer. We're all sorry she had to suffer so much. Yo! Joyce Kinney likes this. That is awkward. Bye. Who was that? Oh, uh, prank call? Oh, yeah, I uh, get a lot of those. I can never figure out who it is. Who is this? Wheelie, wheelie, stupid head. Bet you wished that you were dead. Oh. Listen, I don't know ah! who this is, but you better cut it out. Yo. I'm a cop, you know. Oh, what, are you going to report me on your can't walkie-talkie? I'm gonna hang it. Oh! Up. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. I got three more of these I wrote on a napkin. Uh, all right, three more. Yo. 
return to Germany's most popular late night talk show, Still Awake with Otto von Stad. Some weather we're having. Okay. I was recently in Munich. Did you ever notice how the government buildings there are quite well maintained? Boo! Okay. Nigga. We have no guest. Throw Good tomatoes night. at this nigga! What's wrong with the TV? Nothing, Boo, Chris. All the shows nigga. are in widescreen now, so you can see all the stuff on the sides that you couldn't before. We now return to the Brady Bunch. Hey. See, look. Here's what you used to see. Good night, well, Mike. Good night, Carol. And here's the stuff you missed. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Even he has black men? Come on! Come on! Wow, you sound crazy nervous. In local news, there was a hit and run by a drunk driver today at Quahog Park. Two children are missing. <gasps> I was just there. Yep, yeah. yeah oh, I got I a bet. broken nose. I think this is a sign that maybe it's time to hang up the gloves. What do you want, do you mind? Wow, don't you give me that attitude, PETA. Look, Lois, we're making a lot of cash with this boxing thing. And I need money for bourbon and anime. Well, I just can't understand any of this. Everybody in Japan is either a 10-year-old girl or a monster. Yep, that's, it's kind of hot. what actually. are you I'd... doing? Are you crazy? Pretty you attractive. You can't just jump right back in it. Lois, this can't is you? my life, and this oh. is what I want. Yep, I will like marry you, yep. Mayor Adam West. Oh, great. Yep. I can't wait to tell the gals of my singles group. Oh, no. Ah, oh, come on. This <laughs> is the goal, isn't it? Yo, it'd be like oh, that. We've got to stop Bertram. What are we going to do? Don't worry, Brian. I'll come up with something. Remember, I'm a genius, like Thomas Edison. Thomas, what are you doing? No! Experimenting? No! All right, class, Why? this course is going to cover all the significant moments in human history. Starting with the settling of the Old West, where brave pioneers survived against long odds. How brave. How Honey, brave I have to go into town to get some supplies, so I'm probably going to die. But Aww. if I don't, I'll see you in 18 months with a canvas bag of salt and a tin of whale fat for the children. Aww. I've dug graves out back for all of you in the likely event that you too shall perish. Aww. You were a good man, Abraham. Please scrawl that on a rough-hewn piece of wood in my honor. I shall. <laughs> For crying out loud, Brian, read my book. Judge oh, for yourself. So I'd sooner cares. spend a night watching European porn. Oh, no. Stop! The reign of Henry VIII. <laughs> did you enjoy what I just did for you, sire? Yes, very much so. Wow, when this is over, I am definitely keeping her head. Oh. Boy, Carol's lucky to have a sister. You gotta like murder Lois. all of the You're bitches? telling me. I always wanted a brother or sister, but instead I got a broster. What's a broster? Hey, Peter, you wanna see my paginas? Oh, uh, God, no. I don't. Uh, I, I, don't uh, I don't think I, I, I can I don't do know. that. I don't think I will. I Joseph <laughs> Smith discovering the Book of Mormon. I can't even do it. Oh, an old Con Ed bill. I mean, a New Testament of Jesus Christ, everyone has to sleep with me. What? Oh. And no dancing! Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I'd, I'd go for that. I could totally see me running an entire city where my entire job was just to sleep with all of the women, you know, and, and reproduce so that they can further... All right, time to make all those popular kids pay for ignoring me. Oh. No, Peter, no, you're just a normal high school kid. Oh. Hey, Lance, hey, it, it's off, it's off, it's off, it's off. Ah! Ah! Throw this phone away, Lois. Ah! Ah! Are you okay? No, I came in with my wife and now I can't find her. Oh, I'm sure she's here somewhere. Come on, I'll help you find her. Okay. Will Lois Griffin please come to the courtesy booth? We have a little gift for you. <laughs> I I'm Lois. Oh, for God's sakes, Peter. Yay, Lois! I do have references you can call. You know, I, I, I spent a month as Melanie Griffith's loose skin holder. What? Melanie, Melanie over, over here. here! You look Melanie. beautiful! What? Can't hold on ah! longer! Ah! I should have stayed in bed. Oh. Look, I'm sorry. I'm exhausted, all right? I didn't get any sleep because Brian and the neighbor's dog kept me up all night. Hello? 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 Are you a dog? Yes! I am also a dog. All right! Yeah! We're dogs! Yeah, we're dogs. We're dogs that live near each other. Hey, are you guys dogs? Yeah! We're totally dogs! Yeah, both of us. We now return to Ellen only talks when her guest is talking. 
So you want to hear about my movie? Uh, I had a great, we spent great weekend three months this weekend. Shooting I, I danced Louisiana. all over uh, you know, my it's house. A thriller, I, I, but I tried it's to dance really all over story at least once too. a week. I, I also listen to jazz while I vacuum, which is cool. Anyway, it comes out yeah, Friday, and I got to work with Juliana Margulies. Weekend. who I, could I think there's not like something in the nicer. air, like smog or pollen or po- pollinated smog. Or are you just going to talk over everything? I love that talking I say? on TV. I'll do, I'll do anything to talk on TV. Mm. This is ridiculous. Evil Stewie could be anywhere. You know, this really is all your fault. If you hadn't told me I was going soft, I wouldn't have created Evil Stewie. He w- Nothing worse when somebody tells you that you're going soft. You know what I mean? Because <laughs> some situations can be spit on to be fixed. Like washing your car or your clothes. Pooping in your own chocolate ice cream. Last Tuesday. Wouldn't have escaped, and we wouldn't be trying to track down a murderer. For all we know, he could be killing someone else right now. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh yeah! Oh! 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 You gonna drink the glass? Number 3287. That's the Come on, Peter, I'm here to take you home. I don't know, Brian. This is the only world I know anymore. Peter, you've been in there for 15 minutes. Wow. No, yeah, no, I know it's late. I just need some tropical fish food. Come on, where the hell am I supposed to go? You're in there. Don't worry, fish. I'm going to take care of you, because I know one day you'll do the same for me. I'm sorry, but your friend doesn't have insurance. I don't care what it costs. Just make this man well again. Ah! Thank you, fish. Ah! Dad, ah! where'd you get this car? No, I borrowed it from Craig it He's not home because he got abducted by aliens last night. So do you guys just not do the anal probe anymore? Is that... No, nah, that's more or less been retired. I see, I see. Do you, do you still have the thing? Oh, God. <laughs> Besides, you know me. When I set my mind to something, I am not easily deterred. Like when I tried out to be an Olympic gymnast. <sighs> ah! What? <laughs> You did it, Peter. Why'd you shoot me? Because I'm weird, creepy coach. Now let me give you inappropriate personal shower while I smoke and forbid you to see parent. That will make it better. Nothing soothes someone's violence like them taking an awkward shower with you while low-key trying to be romantical. Written by J.K. Rowling and M. Night Shyamalan. This is... Somebody should look into this sport. Every time a man shows her the slightest glimmer of attention, she rushes into something serious and gets her heart broken like a teenage girl. Hey, Tyler, are you on your way to algebra? Yeah, I'll see you there. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. You're awful! What? The preceding joke was brought to you by men. Men! We don't know what we did. I had a female do that one time, and uh, all I did was call her a female. I know, right? I thought she was a woman, too. I don't know why she got mad. You're not respecting women. You called me a female. I'm like, give it six more years, and calling a woman a woman, it will be verbal sexual assault, punishable by years and years of, of rough and unconsensual butt stuff in the uh, Texas uh, uh, penal system. Keyword, penal. I don't know, anywhere between 35 and 40. Okay, well, let's say 37. How, how about ethnicity? Yeah, he was Asian-American. Asian-American. Are we talking Korean? Are we talking Thai? Are we talking Vietnamese? Maybe Korean. Uh, could have been Japanese, but, but I, I think Korean. Okay, Korean. Now, how about identifying characteristics? Any any marks, piercings? He any... may have had a tattoo. He may have had a tattoo? Did have a tattoo? Which one was it? I, I don't know. It, it, it all happened so fast. You know what? It's fine. I have a preliminary sketch here. Is this the man who assaulted you? Could be. I know, and it's going to be so much fun going with you. Joe hates to fly because they always put him underneath with the dogs. Oh. <laughs> Indonesia better be worth it. Ah! <laughs> <sighs> Can this day get any more stressful? Oh! Yep, that's the same Mexican huh. who did the other guy. I thought of it like that. Wait a minute, you're not serious. That's totally unethical. Yeah, Brian, no one cares what you think. Peter, you could make him your slave. Oh, man, he'd hate that even more than he hates sitcom two-parties. Tootie, it's 829. Now either try that beer or dump it down the sink. Wait, oh, now I have to wait a whole week to find out if she gave in to peer pressure at that drinking party. Yep. 
Well, what do you think of that, Lois? You still mad at me now? Peter, I feel great. I've never felt so in control. Oh, I know the feeling. It's how I feel when I burp really loud in an underground parking structure to assert my dominance. <laughs> Says the king. Hey, this can't be it. This can't be Santa's workshop. This looks like Bridgeport, Connecticut. Oh, oh boy, get ready for the letters. Dear Family Guy bastards, who the hell do you think you are? I'll have you know that Bridgeport is among the world leaders in abandoned buildings, shattered glass, boarded up windows, wild dogs, and gas stations without pumps. So eat my p Jew writers. Oh. All right, Peter, do you have a story that you'd like to share? Oh, yeah, I got one. This one time, me and Joe and Quagmire made a bet to see who could drink the most beer and still drive. And you, you know that water slide in South Attleboro? <laughs> Not the children. Not the children. Yeah! Oh, slide! Some of that. Damn. So, will you stay with me? Well, it's tempting. Paris is such a perfect city. Uh, that is not entirely true. We have a lot of mime-on-mime mime violence. Oh! Oh, I made him break the whole check. Oh! 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 You're gonna hook up with a boy! Really? I know! I can't believe it! Oh, I feel as pretty as Scarlett Johansson! Scarlett Johansson! Scarlett Johansson! Scarlett Johansson! Scarlett! Laura Linney. Oh! Whoops. So, what are we hauling, good buddy? Ugly oh, bitches. I got a flock of birds that were too tired to fly back north. Boy, this is the way to do it, huh, Jerry? Sure is. Think this makes us lazy? Nah, we're still in the V-shape. <laughs> oh, That's no, that one. movie's long gone, like the original ending to Grease. No, I'm not doing it. No. We've been up here for four days. Why did you drive the ah! car here if you didn't know how to get it back down? Look, Sandy, it seemed like a good idea at the ah! time. Obviously, I didn't think ahead. It's so cold. Let's cuddle together for warmth. I I'm, 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 I'm warm enough. <laughs> Can you imagine that? At the end of the Grease movie, the car just keeps going up into the sky, but they don't know how to bring it down. Like, that would be on a thousand ways to die. Yeah, life is full of big decisions. Like deciding whether or not you're going to have time to masturbate. Oh. Peter, I'm going to run and pick up Stewie. I'll be back in five or ten minutes. Well, which is it? Mm -hmm. You know, if you ever want to get anywhere with this girl, you got to ditch that negative attitude. Be like you're, that. you're as bad as Negatron. Do as I command, and we will defeat the Autobots once and for all! Uh, is it bad that I thought you said Nakatron? I thought that he was gonna be naked. Not that I was gonna keep watching, because I would have clicked right off the video if that's what was happening, but... Oh, nope. Not gonna work. Oh, come on. What did we talk about? Autobots always win. You think Optimus Prime's gonna be dead, but then he's not dead. I'm taking this from a robot that turns into a canoe? Uh. When there's a battle on a gently moving river, you'll want me. Yep. Ah, there's the cute little guy now. Hang on. Oh my God, what happened to you? Oh, oh, we, we gotta get you to the hospital. Ah, ah, you're hideous. Who did this to you? Oh, oh, where are my keys? Where's my keys? Where are my keys? Peter, what about Babs? Forget about yourself for a second, Carter. Look what has happened to Jonathan Lipnicki. Oh, yeah. No, you're, you're, you're right. You should probably take care of that. I'll, I'll, I'll be, I'll be here. Hasn't he always been that ugly? The top ranked boxer in all of Rhode Island, Deirdre Action Jackson. Oh. Ugh. I think every Italian in Quahog is here. Yeah, go white girl. Hey, yo, you're getting your grinder on my grinder. Yeah. There it is, Meg. What do you say we take it for a spin? Chris, get off there. You shouldn't be sitting on that. Did he yell, go white girl? What? I think every Italian in Quahog is here. Yeah, go white girl! <laughs> hey, yo, you're getting your grinder on my grinder. Yep, that makes sense. There it is, Meg. What do you say we take it for a spin? Chris, get off there. You shouldn't be sitting on that. Come on! That's fake. All right, you ready? I don't want to do this. Go! 
No. 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 That went exactly as I wanted it to go. What? Don't worry, Brian, I've got it all under control. You're a big canine star. They should be treating you like Spuds McKenzie. Man, I wonder what he's doing now. Now, ladies, approach him slowly. He can't really see anymore. I've injected him with the Viagra. Now, I'm going to roll him on his back, but you're pretty much going to have to do 100% of the work. Oh. This is like the best love scene of all time. Best love scene. Oh, by the way, I should tell you I've got AIDS. Oh. Yeah, they're right over there waiting for me. Ready to go when you are, sir. Poor guys, they both have AIDS. Not okay! Yeah, ice cream sounds great. The only thing is... Mrs. Griffin, could I speak with you and Brian alone, please? Well, of course. Kids, why don't you wait in the car? Okay, Mom. Let's go find the big black sassy nurse. There's That's... always one. There is. You can cry about it, or you can decide to live. It's your choice. Found her. No! Well, it's probably the right move anyway. Those girls seem kind of annoying. Look at them over there, taking a group picture together. I love you! I love you! We're all such good friends! You can tell by the way we're pressing our faces together! And that's where fat girls come from. See, they didn't play the rest of that scene. Now that fat girl gets escorted out the club for being a fat girl. That's real. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Roger that, Neil. We came in peace for all the peoples of the Earth. We read you, Neil. We chose to go to the moon not because it is easy, but because it is hard. Had a lot of help down here, Neil. We have slipped the surly bonds of Earth and touched the face of God. Yeah, if you could just grab some what? rocks, Neil, throw them in a bag, we'll get you home safe and sound. Great, Peter. Nice going. This dinner was a disaster. Eh, Clash of the Titans owl was worse. So you're from Greece. Ah, oh, I've always wanted to go there. What's it like? Yeah, I can't... I can't understand a word he's saying. Yeah, I told you, Lois, only Harry Hamlin can. If you're gonna invite the owl, you gotta invite Harry Hamlin. I will not have Harry Hamlin in this house. Oh, oh no! We're too late! I'm sorry, Carol. But if it helps, you're not the first person to get a bum deal. Mr. Edison, we're going to use your invention to power the world. And Mr. Tesla, we're going to use yours in the background of Frankenstein movies. Oh, I wanted that one. Yeah, I've never been one to hold grudges. I even forgave the man who murdered my son. And although I will never get over the pain of what you did to my son, I forgive you because I believe you are sick and in need of help. Mr. Griffin, this is the Office of City Planning. You requested a variance to build a hot tub off your garage? Oh, yeah. Did I get it? No. I will kill your son! Oh! Your son is dead! Here we are, Christmas night, 1776. The father of our nation, George Washington, is about to boldly cross the Delaware. What's on his arms? Those are water wings. He was terrified of the water. Ah! Easy! Ah! Like anything in the universe? Absolutely. Brookstone massage chair. Really? Are, are you sure? Yep. Never been more sure of anything in my life. Well, except one thing. Good evening, sir. Would you like to hear our specials? No! Pizza! After all, I'm the guy who taught old Asian people how to get on the subway. Ah! Out of the way! Nobody else matters! All right, you made it. Now twirl that long hair sticking out of your face mold mm -mm. and cough. Cough like you never coughed before. <laughs> that would work. Yeah, we'll be a better team than the Warsaw Globetrotters. Dribble, 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 talking shirt. Give to my friend. Spin on finger, two rotations. Dream about window. Go <laughs> to a basketball, go to work in calcium mine. That's not fun. Ah. Nothing is off limits. Jeez, Peter, you're more excited than Adrian Peterson at an Arboretum. Daddy, what kind of tree is that? Man, I want to beat you with so many things around here. Oh. Uh. This is going to be a bigger disaster than Y2 Gay. Three, two, one. I hope my dad's not watching ABC. No. 
<laughs> All right, we're just going to take a quick cap smear. Don't you mean pap smear? No. At this hospital, we obtained the sample using beloved British comic strip roustabout, Andy Cap. Hello, love. Let's have a smear. I'm not letting you do that. You can't even see. That's all right, bird. I goes by smell. Stewie, there's a lot of sex and drugs at these things. You sure you're ready for this? Of course I am. I'm tired of living my life in a tiny little box like some sort of claustrophobic turtle. He's scared inside, he's scared outside. Uh -huh. Everybody hates how you dress, right, Joe? Sorry, I stay out of fashion debates. I've been burned one too many times. Hey, guys, notice anything different? Yeah, Manetti's got a hot new look. The whole thing, it just works. Manetti. Just, uh, two men should never compete over who looks more like a woman. This coming here was a bad idea. Like when I brought museum behavior into my home. Excuse me, we do ask that you don't touch anything. This is idiotic. You're never going to find a turkey in there. Oh, I'll find one. I mean, you're looking at the guy who found a fountain of youth. Uh, he found a fountain of youth? It's very far away from here. No. Ugh, I can't change you back. This whole endeavor was doomed to fail. Like an Asian guy going to a salon. I, I want to have my anus breached. This is for the best. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure they'll be adopted. Oh, God, yeah. I'm still keeping all the gifts from the baby shower. You had a baby shower? Oh! Now this makes it real! Oh, oh my goodness, that's enough cake for you, Mary Beth. Oh. oh! Girls, it is so nice to be part of a group again. And I'm having the best time. Especially yesterday when we all got mammograms. No. If I have cancer... We're all going to Brazil. Yes, and there's so much to learn. For example, did you know that Jesus didn't really die on the cross? So what was the cause of death? Cocaine and severe trauma to the colon. Yeah, I'm gonna need to see those forms. What? Hey, we should go check it out right now. Ordinarily, I'd say no, but that adult kickball league is coming in for drinks, so let's get out of here. Severe trauma to the anus? Hell no. Guys, check it out. I've got flip-up shades on my flip-up uh, shades. Dude, you are the worst. Hey, we're all the worst. All right, you know what? I know something that'll help you sleep. Wait here. Well, I hope so, because I've tried everything. Counting sheep, thinking sleepy thoughts. I even hired the Sandman. Sand and sand and sand and sand and sand and sand and good night. Well, Peter's been doing his best, but... Lately, he seems more focused on marketing his erotic advent calendar. What? All right, kids, let's see what's under Christmas. Oh, another puckered anus. We miss her so much. I know, honey, but if you give it a little time, I'm sure you'll get over her. Huh? Just like you got over your hamster dance Tourette syndrome. Hey, excuse me, Mom, could you please pass it? <laughs> His brain ain't right, but it's fun. We now return to DJ Butcher. DJ Butcher. Hey, bro! Hey! You requesting a song or ordering some sliced meat? Meat! Half a pound of turkey, please! You want a sample? You mean like a slice of turkey? Or like a short section of one musical recording that's been digitally repurposed to be part of a new song? I don't know. I might quit this job. I think we can really knock it out of the park. Oh, we sure can, Lois. We're going to be a great team, like Moses and his buddy who like to collect seashells. Yay! Jackpot. Then let you it sure crush in this, on him. You bet. As sure as I was when I created Lady Gaga. No. All right, listen, fella. Your game is confusion. Zip, zam, zoop. Nobody gets a straight look at nothing. You were right, Peter. This kid's a thief. We did it. Well, look at us. You know, we make a great team, guys. Like Huey Lewis and the Jews. Did they just beat up that small child? Like, word? You don't need money. Sorry, the band's breaking up. Yep. Everybody we says money's bad an until no one's We now movie at a realistic high school. You going down at that karate tournament. I don't think so. You guys do karate? You're both 
Losers. Hey, dude, can you pass me a speck of spaz? Sorry, bruh, all out. You want a cube of fruish? No, I'm not into fruish. I got a tear of laser dragon. Can I handle that? I don't know. Can you? Gum, what the hell is going on? Right, you're not thinking clearly. All right, you've got to agree to this surgery. Because right now, you're as useless as Black Widow is to the Avengers. Oh. So, what's your superpower? Kicking. Oh, right, because none of us can kick. Hey, which one of you guys can kick? Hulk, stop being nice. Sorry. They always need new TSA screeners. Really? Wow, that'd be great. Thanks, Mr. Quagmire. And thanks for taking the time. Most people aren't usually that nice to me. Ugh, gross. Oh. Ah, I wouldn't worry, Lois. I never did very well in school either. I even failed homeroom. Peter mm. Griffin? There. It was awful. I didn't even get to go to my high school prom, but my mom did. Hey, is Crystal ready? Oh, hi, Ronnie. Hey, listen, have my mom home by midnight, okay? How about I plow her in the limo and have her home in 20 minutes? Oh, come on, Ronnie. She bought the dress. Well, for the next 72 hours, I'm going to be harder to find than a nice cat. You need me to clean out your litter box? Mittens. That's some Amber Heard type shit. Hey, come on, Meg. Your only chance at fame would have been as the dog on Frasier. Well, of course I respect my father. He's a vet. Woof. Not that kind of vet. <laughs> you can't always get things right on the first try. Just look at Snoopy's original happy dance. Hey, you having a good time tonight? Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. yeah. Let her know. Let we now return her... to Rocky Dennis no. the Menace. What the hell? Oh, it's you. My wife said I'm not allowed to get mad at you anymore. Got the parents. Let's go, Lois. Wow, they're really gone. You know what that means. Are they going to have sex? finally, finally great Brian. Brian. What? He tricked us. And we're still waiting on that lasagna. Chris, that was the trick. Uh oh. He tricked us. What the hell? Yep, that's how we do. Yep, get up out of there. That's how we do in the hood. Yep, yep, yep. Teabag the world, baby. I hate the guy, but he's good. Hi, Chris. There's my big smart son, my special guy, my Chrissy. Sounds like someone got her vibrator working again. Oh, look oh. out, everyone. Double digit IQ joining the table. Hey, Smarty, think fast. Oh. He knows. He knows it's hot. Because no. he's smart. What? Nurse, who's the worst doctor in this hospital? You are, Dr. Hartman. Good. Put Hartman on this bozo. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to answer this. Hello? Ah, Hartman. Wow. Yeah. That makes perfect Peter, sense. what are you doing? Oh, I'm your ways app today. You on your way to work? Yeah, I am. All right, you will be there in six minutes. Just start heading straight. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> so, how's everything? Take a right, right now! Oh, my God. <laughs> Jeez, okay, calm down. Left! Take a left immediately! Oh my god! Oh! Hey, this one looks cool. Space camp. Spend a week doing intensive math and science, learning from real astronauts. Space camp? I'm sorry, that one must have accidentally gotten in with the rest of them. What are you saying, that I'm too stupid for it? Chris, we're over here. What are you saying, that I'm too stupid for it? Whoa, you picked me. I've been skipped and flipped and reached over so many times, I wasn't sure I'd ever get out. So what are you going to put on me? Jelly? Cream cheese? Maybe some nut butters? Actually, I'm nut just butters. using you to squish a spider. Oh. oh. Yuck. Oh. Yuck, yuck, yuck. We still can use the bread, though. It's still good. Oh, my God. Please be a dog. Please oh. be a dog. Oh, no. Damn! <laughs> oh, my God. It's Doug. Nice hit. Oh, and Elsa underwear. <laughs> this day just keeps getting better. Oh, we finally made it below the storm. Look! I see base camp! Yay! We're gonna be okay! Wait! We have to go back! 
What? What are you talking about? Kids, your mom is clearly delirious from the altitude. I say we leave her behind and marry that hot new assistant from my work. Hell yeah. Ooh, big red button. Snowy, no. No. Uh-oh. Chris, make it stop. Yeah, I'm trying. you, baby. Is that a condom? I'm like a huge penis. Oh. I think we're launching. Oh my god, everyone strap yourselves in! Stewie, hold my hand! No thank you, I prefer to die giving you the finger. Magic 8-Ball, I'm bored. Should I sniff my co-worker's hair? Yes. Yes. He told me to do it! Yeah. Mr. Griffin, if a Magic 8-Ball asked you to jump off a building, would you do that too? Did, did it, did it? Ah! I'm just using that as an example of- I Listen to the toy! <laughs> ah! <laughs> yep, there it is! Yeah. Yes, you heard me right. Cancel my insurance. I've been in this location for 40 years, and never once have I broken a lamp. Good day, sir. God, I hope he's got insurance. Of course he's got insurance. He's been at this location for 40 years. Oh. If this is what it takes to get out of Florida, fine. You know what? You only live once. I am sticking my head out the window. Yes! This is the best version of whatever's so enjoyable about this! Huh? Come on, you can do this. Stewie does it every day. He does? Yep, just put one hand on the rail. He about to die. Damn it! I can't! Uppies! What a baby. <laughs> so you say this gumball machine took your dime and didn't give you a gumball? That's right. Well, I'll take care of that. Hand over the dime, buddy. Come on, hand it over. Don't make this hurt on yourself. Wait a minute. This gumball machine takes quarters, not dimes. Holy crap, it's a setup. Time to make a quick getaway. Yep. Covered in glass. Mom, I'm scared. I don't believe it. Are we really stuck in space? Oh, God, what if we have to live up here for the rest of our lives? I'm gonna miss drinking at the clam. I'll tell you what I won't miss. That waiter who thinks he has to be funny. Yes, I'd like to chop salad, please. And could I get no onions on that? Hmm, I've got a few connections in the back. I'll see what I can do. Yeah, that's funny. If there's one onion on that salad, you can forget the eighty tip you need to live. Nick! That's messed up. Look at it. Excuse me, can I help you? Kick it! Ah! 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 You're a weird guy, Griffin. Hey, got it? We're gonna be okay. Yep, there it is. Ah, crap, yep. this thing was a rental. Yep. Get your tux back, bye! Oh my god! That is covered in poop and throw. Hey, Brian, check it out. Meg's poking around the cargo hold. I'm gonna give her a little scare. This ain't right. That ain't right. That ain't right. <laughs> Ah! Yep. Yep. Close that back on up. Turn that off. Oh, boy. I think this space food has gone bad. Peter, that's a fecal collection bag. Oh, my oh, God. Is a bag for that? Because mine's over there twirling in the air like a slow baton. Well, someone's got to lead this marching band. Ew! Peter, this is Jan. Now, you just oh sit there God. while she and I conspiratorially discuss your haircut in front of you. It looked like he kind of has you. <laughs> okay, Peter. Think. You're a cartoon character. You can conjure up anything in the world to get yourself out of this. So long, Lois and lady I accidentally called sir. The uh, line's of speed. Nah. What am I looking at here? It's mostly small, colorful pictures. Those are emojis. Read them. Okay, it says hey, and then a kissy face, and then like a saucy smirking face, three balloons, and a locomotive. What the hell is all this? It means she likes you. Send something back. Okay. Dearest Teresa, I hope this finds you well. I so appreciated your last communication. No, stop, stop. God, stop, stop. Just send her an eggplant and the erupting volcano. Yep, there it is. Cup of joe and a greasy roll, please. Okay, whatever this is, I already hate it. Sorry, I'm up against a deadline on a big story. Major ramifications. Lid, prepare to be blown off. Really hope Best you guys can hear me to fart sniff just at now. the park. I, um... I don't, I, I don't think this is an article for human readers. I'm standing here at the home of the Griffin family, chatting with their neighbors. So the Griffins might be dead. How does that make you feel? Griffin dead? I take. Oh, I'm about to rob them. Oh. 
No, no, they might be dead. They, they also might still be alive. He's okay. I, I take. That's racist. First of all, I feel like black people be the first people to steal the house, right? Hey, come on, Quagmire. Let's go for a walk, huh? Get some fresh air. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, my sake. God. You're going to have a baby in your butt, man. Oh, Can't my God. leave. Heather within five miles is coming. Are you Glenn within five miles? I can take my glass eye out if you want to try something different. Oh, my God! I got a good feeling about her. Maybe she's the one. Let's do it in the garage. It's kind of cold, but we can do sweaters on, pants off. All right. Guess who just wrote ten facts you didn't know about Jerry Seinfeld? Is one that he's Jewish? Guess who just wrote nine facts you didn't know about Jerry Seinfeld? He likes classic cars. Guess who just wrote eight facts you didn't know about Jerry Seinfeld? You probably said he was Jewish a second time. All right, new article. One fact you didn't know about Michael Richards. You can't use that word in an article. And I will find a new show to write about. Yeah! Oh. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. That's racist. I deserve to be customer of the week. You don't. Well, they probably see a woman like me and think, <laughs> she's got it all. They don't. Now, I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. I, I feel like I really vibe with everyone there. You don't. Now, I'm one of their best customers. You know, if I stopped showing up, they'd probably wonder where I went. They wouldn't. Because I'm a nice person. You're not. I tip in cash. So? And I can't think of one reason why they wouldn't pick me. I can. Well, thanks for listening, Stewie. I had no choice. Mm -hmm. Are they sign languaging? Oh. Ooh. Oh, hey, Stewie. Hey, you. Look, he left his phone. I'm just gonna nudge it with my knee into this empty pizza box. And it's stuck to my knee. Let's, uh, let's just go. Good Lord. All right, we gotta just throw that phone away and end this once and for all. Yeah, no kidding. White wine's <clears throat> in bad shape. He looks worse than I did after that day at the beach. I spanked somebody else's kid. What type of shit? I gotta hand it to you, Brian. You were a better blue-collar guy than I expected. You finally earned this nice cold beer. Thanks, Stewie. Oh. Ah, you flush it. It scares me when it goes away. Now, I'm gonna show them that I deserve to win this award. I need this. Just like I needed my own Gregor the Mountain Clegane. Next. Hi, Gil. Uh, can I get... Pound of honey ham. Cut it thin. Oh, excuse me. I believe I was next. A step aside, lady. Yeah, hi, Gil. Can I try a piece of the pepper turkey? That works, Here in too. the props department, some sweaty guy is working on the Peter Copter. That's right. You know, a lot of people don't realize SEAL Team 6 actually completed their mission in this puppy. Oh, cool! Family guy! Over here! I'm down here! Oh, hell no! No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no. That's what I wanted you to think. What are you talking about? Yeah, I scammed you, man. Took you for a ride, Jack. You thought you were a big wheel till you found out squares don't roll, man. What? Dig this, Hepcat. The stew man spun you round like a Bill Evans 45. Wait, what's happening? I'll tell you what's happening, Brian. The whole family's becoming Jack Kerouac's insufferable friends. No one wants us at their apartment party, you dig? Get hip to that daddy or skit scared out of the house. And we don't know how to end these shows anymore, so we just do nonsense. Well, ugh, this is a bad idea. But I guess sometimes Fox has bad ideas, huh? Oh. Let's all just sit here for a moment and remember that this was a thing. Sons tucks in. I'm in. Yeah, thanks, Quagmire. Oh, wow, this would be great. Hey, can you make us X-Men? Ah. What a surprise. Man, this is going to be a fun day. Much better than that day I tried tag body spray for sick cats. <laughs> oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Oh, oh, no. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ew, ew, ew. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, no, no, you're cute. You're cute. I, I, I don't want to pet you, though. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, oh, 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 what are you going to do? Uh, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Oh, oh, no, okay. No, yeah, no, this, this spray is not for me. Boy, am I going to enjoy this meal. Not like last night when I didn't have time to poop before the guests arrived. Do I have time? You know what? I'm going to go for it. Son of a bitch. Looks like I'm going to have to pile dinner on top of that. Hey! 
Hey, guys, how are ya? Come on, guys, this is trespassing and it's against the law. Maybe we should just let the clam go and, I don't know, spend more time with our families. Yeah, I tried that. I just spent most of the time testing Chris to see if he's autistic. <laughs> Not overly affectionate. Hey, did you get the license plate of that handsome guy who ran me over last night? Ha <laughs> ha, clever. So, is there anything we need to talk about? I don't know. Is there anything we need to talk about? I guess not. Well, I guess not, too. Thanks, R.B. Back at you, R.B. We just click together. Like all the pieces in Chris's first model set. Okay, lay out the pieces, find the cockpit, open the glue, take a sniff. <sighs> And this will be my life now. Oh. Uh, just what we need, another girl. You said it. Wow, I'd like to play doctor with her and, and remove her inflamed appendix before it bursts, causing sepsis. Giggity, giggity, giggity. <laughs> Peter, what Who's the he? hell are you doing? Beating his meat to tell I can't sleep, Lois. I'm too excited for I thought he was watching deep fake nudes. Uh, Peter, would you get in the damn bed? I'm gonna have the best birthday party ever. I gave out all my invitations yesterday. Hey, Chris, um, I was wondering if you'd like to come to my party tomorrow. Thanks, Dad. I'd love to. Yeah. Oh, no. M-E-G. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Uh, nothing. Sports. Nothing. Birthday sports. No, just sports. Oh, okay. Maggie, you're not invited to my party. I did it! I killed her! She's dead! Oh, ow, ow, ow! Mommy! 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 Oh, yeah, that's right. Come on, Stewie, we're going. Just a moment, Brian. I'm pretending I'm a fireman. I love playing pretend. My name's Peter, and I work in the brewery. Now I'm going to put on my pants and go talk to my co-workers that these pants have stool in them. Well, Chris and Meg are off to school. Guess it's just you and me now. You want a popsicle? Huh? Breakfast popsicle? Whoa, there's vodka in here. Now what? Uh, now what? Now what? What did you want? Wait. Uh, all right, let's go play in the hot yard. I'm two and a half hours late for preschool. You did? Wait, who wants milk? Let, let me quick just check in the freezer. <laughs> you, you burger, it, here's your veggie burger. It, 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 it'll, it'll thaw out. It'll, you'll suck on it. It'll thaw out nice. Got a all right, I'm out of here. Uh, this is a perfect amount of drunk for a filet of fish. Peter, yep. do we have to watch this? This out. is what rednecks watch, Brian. Peter, that's, that's disgusting. That's Here, spit that's in gross. this cup instead. That's gross. Oh, there's my apple juice. Stewie, wait, don't. Yep. Where's my money? You gonna give me my money? Ah, uh, never mind. Yep, don't help him. Ahem. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm gonna walk. Has it ruined the taste of my chips? Dang it! Not bad enough for me to not still eat them, but still bad! Through the house and make sure everything's cat friendly. Okay, this is a problem right here, kind of in this whole area. Your front windows are west facing, that's good. We'll make for very cozy afternoon sun naps. Still getting a pretty bad vibe from over here. Lastly, catnip is a class B narcotic. It is a drug. It is a drug. Yeah, we don't we don't keep any of that stuff around. Look, this is going to sound racist, but... Stop. No, no, hear me out. It's just... Stop. All I'm saying is... Stop. It's just... Stop. Norwegians can't dance. Oh. oh. That's actually not as bad as I thought it would be. It is clearly he has not seen me dance around the Skansen tree on Jolofton for true, yeah? Yeah, we can do hopping like Lutefisk in the almond pot. Oh, boy. Family guy, we googled Norway for this joke. At least her legs go up high. <laughs> that's a that's a good wife right there. Okay, Stewie. This is favorite Belarusian children book called Good Night Moon of Chernobyl. Good night, Chernobyl Moon. Good night, Radiation House. 
Good night, melted phone. Good night, glowing milk. Good night, bleeding grandpa's eyes. Good oh. night, two-headed cat. Ooh. Good night, nobody. Good night, blocks and blocks and blocks of nobody. The end. Next book, Everybody Poops, Blood. Thanks for having us over. Yeah, it's a wonderful dinner. And on this beautiful new china, you guys have a lot of new stuff. Yeah, Lois has been splurging her ass off. Yeah, she has. You know, she bought me something yesterday, but uh, I'm not going to tell you what it is. I want you to guess. So just cl close your eyes. It's a soccer horn! I know what it is! Oh, no! So, uh -oh. thanks to Natalia, we've been spending so much more time together. Let me tell you, Joe, it's really been a rediscovery. Hmm. Joe, we time is just as important as me time. Okay. We've actually been watching the middle together. It's so funny. Isn't Yay. it funny, Peter? It is actually funny. At least three times an episode, we turn to each other and we say, That's, That's just, just like, like us. us. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? It sounded funny. But you had to be there. Well, I was able to imagine myself there, which is why I chuckled. My God, you know what this means? You're all accessories to my escape. He's right. We're fugitives from the law. What the hell is wrong with you? I'm a dog, all right? I have a very tough time standing up in the car. All right, Chris, if we're going to find that misprint dollar, we have to retrace your steps. Now, where'd you go after your birthday party? Well, first I drank a four loco, and then I rode my bike down to the hair salon and shouted, Nope! at all the women who came out. Huh. Call me next time you do that. Hi, Meg. Unbelievable. Can I have a can of chaw and a fork? Do you need this phone number on here? Meh. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's eyed. Daddy, you're awake! <laughs> oh, Carter, <laughs> I'm so relieved. <sighs> what happened? Where am I? Oh, you had a heart attack, Daddy, but you're all right now. Yeah, he cool. What the hell is that? Oh, it's an African-American heart monitor made by your company. What? Yes, it has two settings, Barry White and Bill Cosby. Leap, 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 leap. My company makes no such thing. Well, you see, Daddy, when you were in a coma, Peter stepped in and took charge of Pewdishman Industries. We now return to slightly too early comedy club audience member. Not like when Clinton was in the White House, huh? When Clinton was in the White House, all you needed to vote was a piece of duct tape and a... <laughs> yes, yes! But things are different with the Republican majority. They're totally in the pocket of the oil companies. I mean, the President of the United States might as well be... <laughs> Amen! Why not? Why not, right? But I guess it could be worse. The other day, my wife asked me if her ass looked fat in her jeans. And I'm like, honey... Oh, no! <laughs> Where are you gonna go? I don't know. Somewhere far away. Maybe China. I hear they got NASCAR there now. All right, Tom, you're squinting. You're anticipating. Don't do not do that. Carl, you can take your fist out of your own mouth. Bruce, great. Why does the news reporter look like he both sucking balls and eating anus at the same time? Is that just me? I'm not even going to ask what Brian's doing. He looks like he's open for business. You know what I'm saying? We're going to edit that out. Great work. Bruce seems like the only gamer here. Thanks. It's okay to look the other way when y'all pass me on the street with y'all's wives. I understand. Well, they're gone. It's all right. I'll be okay. And I definitely won't have any flashbacks of our happy times together to convince me otherwise. Painting the walls means happy times. Oh, we were so happy. And now we're fighting with paint to show we're having fun. God, I miss those paint fights. But then the music slows down because the shuttle blew up and it really hit home. I don't know why we painted that day. But then we picked up the pieces and started painting again. Yay, we overcame! I gotta get my family back. And who am I? I am a fly on the wall. A fly who's seen it all. Do it! Ah, damn it, now we gotta repaint. Oh, no. 
Ooh. Max, stop staring at Mr. Griffin. I'm sorry, Peter. I'm afraid she's got a father's libido. What can I say? I'm a vegetarian. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I am going to use that. <laughs> Fritz, what's all that lotion for? Are you a scientist, Mom? I'm a scientist. It's for masturbating. Time machine? I don't know you had a time machine. Yeah, I built it after I got bored with that European CNC. The pig goes. Wank! The cow goes. Shazoo! It most certainly does not. The rooster goes. Kikrigi! Where? Where does the rooster say that? The monkey goes. Macaque! No, oh, no, 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 it does not. <laughs> the elephant goes. Fwamp! Oh, yeah, kinda. Pardon me, sir, I'd like to join. What are your qualifications? I have a British accent, I'm possibly homosexual, I never brush my teeth, and my wife is ghastly. Bombs away! What the? Can I help you, Edward? Yeah, I'm here for the early bird special. Are Ooh. those new slacks? What's that now? Are those? What type of porno is this? Ah, right, so this is Sniper Wolf, after she's far past the wall, what is she, what, 89 in this? And that's Faye's sensor, but he's like 104. That's the only way he looks out of shape, is if he's super old. That guy's cool in real life, though. Those new slacks? I got these on special at Caldor. Who drove you there? My nephew. Ah, oh, that was nice of him. I forgot why I came over. Are those new slacks? We now return to Sesame Street. Now on HBO. Oh. Be yeah! a cookie monster. I just realized what that meant. Homies out here eating all the cookies. No, 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 no. Okay, maybe I come around this no, side. No, 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 no. Okay, maybe I climb over top. No, 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 no. You need help building more fence? Okay, come on over. Now let's go to Ollie Williams with the Adopted Pet of the Week. Who wants this dog? Thanks, Ollie. And now let's go to Peter Griffin with you know what really grinds my... Tom, what are you doing? You don't work here anymore. Well, Diane, I have an exclusive story. And I can't figure out how to check my email from home. Did you check your TCP IP sentence? Yes, I did, Ollie. Enable cookies? Yes, Ollie. You want this dog? No, thank you, Ollie. Lois! I know how to get her attention. Lois! I'm about to drink my first soda! Better come stop me! Mmm, that must be the sugar. Oh, God, that's good. Rupert, suddenly I want to run. Chase me! Oh, now I'm sad. People with mustaches look out for each other. Hey. Oh, hey. Hi. Hey, Jeffrey, Peter Griffin has a mustache. No way. Way. Oh. Oh, no. Hey, Cleveland, come on in. Surprise! 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 What the hell's he doing? Sorry, Cleveland, he wanted a surprise party, and this is how he thinks it works. Surprise! Surprise! There you go, that's the spirit, buddy. There's a little bit of good in everyone. Except that president guy from the Hunger Games. He was pretty bad. This year, in addition to the Hunger Games, we're going to do the special Hunger Games. I'm Andy. I love you, Andy. Come on, guys, fight. Somebody threw out a whole ah, couch, and ah. it's in great shape. Yeah, you put a little Febreze on that, scrub it out a little bit, look great in your apartment. You know what? I, I, I know we have a dangerous job to do here, but I'm taking this. I'm taking this couch. All right, ready? All right, one, two, three. Uh, okay, all right. Uh, and, uh, uh, easy, easy, okay. easy, easy, right. easy. Wait, 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 wait. Stop, 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 stop. What? No, 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 twist it. I am. No, 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 I, no, 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 no. Other way, what, other way, you twist it the way? wrong way. What do you want me to do? Just look down, all right? Just, just look, look, look at me, look what I'm doing. Yeah. All right, see the way I'm twisting it? Yeah. All right, turn it that way from your end. Okay. Okay, just, no, no, ah! no, 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 all right, all right, all right, just, hey, just put it, put, put it down, put just, it down, just drop it. All right, all right. All right, all right let's, let's just hang on and figure this out. <sighs> Yummy. Watch this. <sighs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> like the movie The Ring. Awesome. Not awesome. Not ah! awesome. Come back here, you. Ah! Giggity, giggity, crabbity, giggity. Honda, a stormtrooper's all over the place.
place. Shouldn't we be getting out of here? All right, all right, all right, all right. okay, all right, okay, I, I, I got it, I know what we're gonna, okay, okay, all right, you, we, we, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take the cushions off, unscrew the legs, take the mattress out, and this whole thing's gonna be a lot simpler. It's easier than we're making it. All right, go, 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 go. All right, twist it counterclockwise. I am twisting it. You're twisting it the other way. No, I mean counterclockwise from where I'm standing. So, so that, so then you, so, so clockwise. So yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah. So you twist it clockwise. And okay. Okay. Go. Ah. All right. Okay, you know what? Put, put it down. Put it down for a sec. My fingers are killing me. Huh? And they're shooting at us. All right. You know what? Lift it up tall ways. Okay. Put, oh, for Christ. Oh, it's wedged. It's wedged. All right. Okay. All right. You know what? It's not going anywhere. Let's just take off. We'll deal with it later. All right. You get in the cockpit, and I'll, I'll just, I'll hang on to this thing as we go. Go, go, go! Ah, oh, damn. Oh my god, why is this anus? Ugh! Ugh! Yo, anus do all that? Alright, let's get this statue out of here. Yo, oh my god! Why are y'all stealing? I guess you only paid for driver's side airbags. Yeah, ah! when I bought this, I was dating a girl I didn't like. You you drive a school bus? <laughs> no, silly. I take the bus. I'm in high school. What the hell? You said you were 23! Yeah, and you said you love me. No! Ah! Well, I guess you got me there. Hey, Quagmire. Sorry to bother you, but we're following up on a tip. You're disgusting. Take him away. We've got all the awesome evidence we need. I'm sorry, Mrs. Quagmire, but my sentence stands. 20 years. Mr. Quagmire, I'll give you 24 hours to get your affairs in order. Oh, my God. Oh, don't think of it as 20 years. Think of it as two 10-year-olds, you sick freak. Ah! What the deuce? Ah! Well, hello there. I say, you're a cute little fellow. Tell me something. What do you think about Rose McGowan? <coughs> yeah, she makes my turtle head go in, too. Oh, my God. Look down there. Oh. Uh -huh. Well, we've got some rope. Quick, Peter, you're Let the only one strong enough to carry two people. Let him die! Don't help! <sighs> All right, I got him! Pull me up! Peter, we can't do it! You're too heavy! Keep going, you're almost dead! I found a rock I like. Good evening, family. Champagne? Hmm? Maybe open that face. Wow! Ah, my eye! Appearance is being covered everywhere. I can't believe we really did it. I just hope we don't get caught. So what? Mom will just ground us and take away screen time, and then realize that without screens, she has to entertain us and immediately give it back. Stewie, destroying a statue is a felony. If we're caught, we'll go to prison. Prison? I can't go to prison. Peter watched all six seasons of Oz with me and a baby Bjorn. I'm too young to have someone go poo on my face. Well, there's... Really no good age for it to happen. That's true. Oh, hey, guys, what's the word? Uh, bird? Bird is the word. But we were wondering if you'd take us for a spin in your new car. Yeah, that's a great idea. Hop in. Vroom! 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 Wow! <laughs> Rupert, what happened to your eye? Brian, did you pull one of Rupert's eyes off? No, why would I do that? Maybe your turtle did it. Nonsense. Sheldon is a gentle soul. He wouldn't hurt anybody. Well, come on, let's get downstairs. Lois will be here any minute. Oh. Oh. Another bottle? You're the only one. Ow! My eye! God, why Jesus. I remind you I can't read yet? Bro, why can I feel these injuries when they happen to cartoon characters? Makes no sense. My eye hurts now a little. Yet I can only imagine Madeline would say, take me out of this disgusting French hospital and find me some real parents. <laughs> ah, paper cut! A razor blade? Who the hell uses a razor blade as a bookmark? Huh? 
Mr. Quagmire, wait. Your sentence has been commuted. You will not be serving prison time after all. Commuted? I don't understand. Hello, Glenn. Mom? Yes, she gave a little... <laughs> she basically ate his anus in order to get him out of jail. One can only hope that one's mother would be so dedicated because I don't think my mom would take that one for the team. <laughs> Even though she better. <laughs> What's going on here? By the way, Your Honor, your fly is down. Well, let's just say some new DNA evidence was produced. Ah! An impressive amount, I'd say. Another bottle? Oh, uh, that's me. Ow! You dick! Ow! Oh! All right, very funny, Stewie. What? What do you mean, what? You replaced my Jack Daniels with flat diet Coke. No, I didn't. And you're noticing this at 8.20 in the morning? What has happened to your life? Do you need to talk? Just stay away from my booze. It wasn't me, Brian. Well, if it wasn't you, who was it? I mean, there's a lot of weird stuff going on around here lately. Just yesterday, somebody gave Peter a hot butt. La 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 la, regular life. La 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 la. Ah! Ow! Ah! <coughs> oh! Damn it! No! Oh! <laughs> Why? Why do you write all your twos backwards? <laughs> I think that's the funniest laugh I've laughed in like three months, bro. Well, you know it's a two, so why are we talking? Fix it or you're fired. You know what? I thought working in a cubicle at a mid-sized printing company would be the adventure of a lifetime. It's time to set things right. Here you go, Warren. Merry Christmas. $11,000? Yes, it's the maximum check amount I'm authorized to cut. Cash it fast. Merry Christmas, cash it fast. Merry Christmas, cash it fast. And then somebody replaced Damn! Meg's sleeping pills with Alka-Seltzer. People are going to miss me when I'm... <laughs> but I'm sure there's a perfectly ah! logical explanation for those things. Sometimes... Whoa. What the fuck? was close. Yeah, how'd that thing fall over? Okay, who replaced my glasses with forks? I mean, they're real good for seeing forks, but not what? much else. It seems like you should maybe be a little more thoughtful with your choices. What are you talking about? I'm just having a little fun. For God's sakes, I've just been handed the coolest freaking toy on the planet. Well, you know, except for hungry, hungry Alec Baldwin's. Yep. He gonna be hungry as hell in prison. Didn't he get charged for accidentally shooting his co-actor or whatever? That shit sucks. I, I'm not, I, I'm not even touching the lever. Right. That's officially the latest any of us have ever been up. Ooh. Oh, a little tired, Stewie. No, I just yawned because somebody else yawned. I could do this all night. You tired? Oh, no. At home, they call me the night. <laughs> What's up? Slamming pantsuit. You probably don't recognize me because I'm in corporate. So am I. This is corporate. <laughs> a little too much so, if you ask me. <laughs> I, I try to have fun, right? I mean, you know, we're not, we're not landing planes here. Our company manufactures aircraft landing gear systems. Yep. Uh -huh. Well, I am going to fly us over a few more drinks. So, who's this Merry Christmas everybody keeps talking about? <laughs> That's very clever. I don't recognize you. Which department are you in? Well, right now, I'm in boob assessment. Ew. That's really how that works in real life, too. Hey. Hey! Need a hand? That's okay. I texted Bonnie. Ah! Oh, hang on. She just texted me a thumbs-down emoji. Yeah, I, I will take ah! that hand. Ah! Quagmire? <laughs> well, here we are. Oh, and if you hear the guys call me Poopy Thumb, it's just a fun nickname. It's not something that actually happened. Hey, Poopy Thumb! It was golden spicy brown mustard from my sandwich. How many times do I have to say it? <laughs> okay, no need to relitigate what four of our peers saw. Okay, we hear you, Peter. Loud and clear. Yeah, we'll fix this problem. Well, you guys are creeping me out. All right, I'm going to exit while discreetly checking out the hot chick by the door. I'm your children's teacher, Miss Laura. And like pretty much everyone in America right now, I'm very high on legalized edible pot. <laughs> it's 
crazy how much your kids look like you. <laughs> Good evening, Cohog. Tonight, Channel 5 mourns the loss of a dear colleague, my mustache. Oh. And as per the wishes of my mustache, his ashes were sprinkled off the coast of Acapulco, where he was born. Well, that'll do it for us here. Thanks for watching Channel 5, the most trusted name in news. Oh, crap. Oh, come on. Oh. It was my turn. I found out I'm a cat. I don't care what you did to convince yourself that you're a cat. I think my genetic makeup would disagree. Okay, Brian, if you're really a cat, prove it by jumping off your roof. If you land on your feet, safe and sound, I'll agree that you're a cat. That's it. <laughs> Damn it! And who got candy cane all over the couch? <laughs> I don't believe it! We climbed Mount Everest! Isn't it amazing, Brian? You can see for... Oh, you're doing your pee thing. Right. I don't really know what the point is. I mean, there's no way other dogs can smell this. Trust me, Stewie, they'll know. They'll know the world is now mine. No way. Boy, I have a whole new respect for Hayden Panettiere. Who's Panettiere? Giggity. I'm pulling up, you ready? Oh, what? hey, Peter, listen, I can't work tonight. I'm spent. That last trick was like trying to use an empty bottle of hand soap. But oh, God. Work. I set up five appointments. That's a lot of money. Sorry, I can't do it. You're just gonna have to cancel them. What did you say to me? Peter, what oh. are you doing? You tripping, boy? Oh! You're going out if I tell you you're going out. Ooh! I got highlights, I went shopping, and I had my lights. So it's tighter now. Ooh, Peter, shit. I think Lois might be having a midlife crisis. No, 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 nothing nothing. I can't smush out of her. Just give me a couple hours with her. We be, I'll, I'll, I'll get her right back. Matter of fact, might need a couple days. Meg, I'm going to need you to go to the adult superstore, hook your boy up with uh, five boxes of, of condoms, the rib ones, because <laughs> she's... She's going through it. And also seven bottles of Astro Glide. After 15 continuous minutes of smushing, it starts to smell like a tire fire if you're not WD-40ing it up. You know what I'm saying with the, with the lubrication. Come on, dudes. Who wants to hop in my wheels and head to the beach for some ultimate frisbee? <sighs> yeah, Sheldon, I'm with you. Oh, I can't. I can't do that. Step right up. Everybody take a chance on a whack a big a pussy. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom. This is not what I thought it was. <laughs> you hosting Family Feud? No, I'm a pimp. Um, Big Pete, if we're going to be sitting, may I use my donut? I don't care. Dang, Quagmire, you're lucky. He take care of you. Yeah, no, no, it's great. Um, I'm making a lot of money. I'm actually really happy. I'm actually very hungry. Nobody's gonna want you if you're fat. What's the day today? Dad, why don't your checks have any writing on them? Why don't your shelves have any trophies on them? I've obviously caught you at a bad time. Lois, why don't my checks have any writing on them? Well, Peter... What? That's just a wide pad of post-its I gave you. What? So that million-dollar check you gave me yesterday is no good? I quit my job, man! I will ah! not see you Monday. Come on, Stewie, we're going. Just a moment, Brian. I'm pretending I'm a fireman. I love playing pretend. My name's Peter, and I work in the brewery. Now I'm going to put on my pants and go talk to my co-workers that these pants have stool in them. Hmm? Hey, Lois, you should do that thing that I like. Ah! Hey, kids, have you seen my wallet? Oh, ah! Son of a bitch! Ah! Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we have now reached our cruising... Ah, damn it! Chris, would you like to read your personal essay? Okay, Mrs. Donovan. The first thing that Mrs. Donovan does when she gets home from school is put on sweatpants. Then she eats a whole tube of cookie dough, but she must be allergic to it because there are tears coming out of her eyes, and she always throws up right after. Then she puts paper doll clothes on a picture of a sonogram. Chris, I think you should stop. What? I'm doing the best I can. Most have and most speaking. Uh, yeah, I'm looking for a friend. Last name Keebum. First name Lee. Yeah, hang on now, check. Uh, hey, guys, do I got a leaky bum? Come on, look at the stools. Uh, is there a leaky bum? Ah! I check the rear. I know I got a leaky bum. 
then you probably shouldn't be handling food. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's amazing! That's the coolest thing ever! I'm gonna stir up some drama, make this party interesting. Excuse me, uh, could I have your attention, please? Hi. Hi, I'm Chadwick Redmayne from the regional office. Unfortunately, since people only use printers now to print out boarding passes for their grandparents, 40% of you will be laid off as of Monday. Oh, and whoever drinks the most shots keeps their job. <gasps> See? That's how you get a party started. What do you mean you don't have our names on there? My wife and I absolutely have to be on this flight. I'm doing the best I can, sir. Do you have your confirmation number? I think you'll find all the information you need on here. Sir, this is just a piece of paper with the word South written on it. Can I speak to your supervisor? <laughs> and then I go and spoil it all by saying something stupid like I love you. Boy, I forgot how great that song is. I know, right? It's definitely my favorite romantic love song sung by a father to his daughter. I myself am a student of the pleasures of the flesh. Wow, 3 a.m. We practically shut the place down. And quite a night. We got to sing two songs. Do you mind if I kiss you? Actually, no. I should chew no. some gum first. I had bologna for dinner. Get over here. Mm -hmm. oh! oh, yeah, that's good kiss, baloney. Baby, I miss my wife so much. Thanks for understanding that we can't do anything. I just want to cuddle. Oh, you're so sweet. I'm just doing what a man should do, respecting the sacred institution of marriage. And now, straight to sleep. Yeah, well, you only have one Nielsen box. You don't have the clout to affect national shows. Oh, damn it. I guess that means I'll never get to see an episode of Superman where Clark Kent and Lois Lane finally get together. Lois, I love you, and I want there to be no more... Some of the spiciness from my Dorito just went into my eyeball. Shit, spicy as hell when you're tasting it with your eyeball. I give Dorito that. Oh, damn. Secrets between us. I am Superman. Oh, my God. The only thing that can kill me is kryptonite. Or latex. Or lambskin. What about polyurethane? All that. All that stuff. Close your eyes, Heather. I've got a surprise for you. None of your business how much it was. He bought her a scarf, and it actually goes well with her colors. Peter, don't you see what's going on here? Your son's relationship with that doll is better than our own marriage. Peter? Hey, can me and Ramon go ride shirtless bikes? Oh! Oh! That's real. What are we gonna do? It's like that in the hood, bro. People gonna try you. You gotta have to hurt somebody, and then they'll respect you. <laughs> there ain't no respect before violence, bro. Well, where I'm from. What about him? Let's face it, Lois. The kid's an idiot. What the hell happened to all the smart genes in his family? I mean, I invent the razor blade comb, and my kids are doing nothing. I mean, when Chris grows up, will he even be able to get a job or uh, take care of himself? And what's he gonna do when we die? Ooga chaka, ooga, ooga, ooga chaka. I can't chaka, stop ooga, this ooga, feeling. Ooga chaka, ooga, 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 ooga chaka. Deep ooga, ooga, inside of me. You want to eat? Get up to that bar and earn your keep. Well, what should I ask for? 500? You're not worth that much. You're trash. Ask for two. Hi there. You want a party? And can I have some of your bread? Hi, handsome. You can't have my bread, but you can have something of mine that smells like bread. <gasps> Okay, let's go. You mean the earwig fortress? No thanks. I haven't been in there since I won the Battle of the Wheelbarrow. Yeah, too fast and too smart for you, earwigs. Now to continue clearing the yard, collecting moisture and sleeping in wood. May I be excused to bring this plate of moisture to the crawl space? Gentlemen, it has come to my attention that there is a Chinese among us. Rest assured, he will be found. Security is launching a full-scale investigation into the genealogy records of every single one of our employees. This man will be found, and there will be dire consequences. Too bad about that Chinese guy, huh? That looks heavy. It's only one thing. Look at the bright side. At least you're independent. 
It's Christmas time. Yeah, Lois, I knew it was Christmas a week ago when the O in the Pornhub logo became a wreath. Same. Nice. Oh my god, how are we supposed to get across this? We, we have to walk on those ladders? Guys, be sure to look down the whole time. It's really deep and freaky and disorienting. What type of shit? Hey, Doc! Oh my god! Dad! It's okay, there's a huge pile of dead bodies down here that cushion my fall. Now, to make sure you don't forget your chores, I made you each a list, and I want all of these completed by tomorrow. Sorry, I can't do chores. My trick elbow is acting up. Is that your card? No. Oh, boy, it's worse than I thought. Do you want an excuse to not go home this Christmas? Then fly Northwest Airlines. At Northwest Airlines, thousands of employees are dedicated to delaying and canceling flights. No way we're taking off on time. Don't worry, I'm taking this flight back to the gate. Do you think Jeff will make it home this year? No way, because Jeff flew Northwest. Thanks, Northwest. We now return to Hard Knocks CFL, training camp with the Toronto Argonauts. I hope you make it. You're real good. No way, not as good as you. I hope you make it. What are you going to do with all your money? Oh, probably just save it. Yeah, that's real smart. Well, back to my book. Hi, what can I do for you? I'll handle this. My husband wants to open a checking account. Okay, Justin Peter Griffin. It's actually just Peter Griffin. So this is not your birth certificate? Oh, my God. Your first name is Justin? It is? Wow, I never noticed that. I'm a Justin. Peter, it doesn't change a thing. You're still the exact same person. I beg to differ. Oh. Nice. Let's crank it. <laughs> crank it? You hear this, clown? I only use it to listen to podcasts. All right, Chris, Meg loves to listen to music when she sleeps. Let's see how she likes this. Uh, Dad, I don't think that's how it works. Yo! This had nothing to do with the harmonica. Unhand me! What do you think you're doing? Okay, Stewie, you're gonna help Daddy by holding his iPad while he watches season one of House of Cards. Where was the house? Where was the house of cards? Time to go. Whoa, whoa, a little wobbly. Guess my legs fell asleep. Ah! Ah! Stewie, Daddy can't feel his legs. Go get help. I'm hanging from a door, you idiot. Excuse me, sir. What's the next stop for this train? Ah! Ugh, I hate when they let the infirm ride on the train. Next stop, Raleigh Daily Station. Ah! Sir, you owe an apology to me and all the good people of Raleigh Daily Station. There, now you got a fresh new diaper, Stewie. What are you talking about? What's going on? I think you're getting a diaper change. Ah, get that poop field thing away from Yo! me! Ow! Oh, Ow! Oh God, it's cold! Whoa, smells like somebody needs a diaper change. Damn right I do! Now get this turd-filled sack off! Oh my god, it just went back in my body! I just wish we didn't have to borrow money from a loan shark. I mean, that guy seemed pretty serious. Okay, and just a couple of remaining items. Please indicate here if I look like a schmuck to you. I'm gonna say no. Great, then please check here and initial there. Uh, next, do you think this is some kind of game? Um... No. Okay, initial please. And finally, my date of birth. Was it yesterday? Here we go. Next question. And remember, no phones, people. Playing an honest game. No phones. Okay, in what country... No phones. I'm seeing phones. In what country... No phones. I've been pretty cool about this so far. It's a gentleman's game. In what country can you find the monuments called... I see phones. I see... All right, you know what? That's it. Trivia night over. Three cotton picking weeks and no one's gotten a single answer wrong. Everyone's like, hey, settle down. We're not using our phones. I see you using your damn phones. I must notify Gossip Girl. Pass this along to Gossip Girl. It's me. 
I'm Gossip Girl. You know what part I like the most? Walking around the locker room naked and offering people sections of a tiny clementine. Clementine? Oh, thank you. Clementine? No. None for me, thanks. Clementine? Yes, thank you. Clementine? Yeah, I'll have one. Ooh, softly. Sorry. Yes, I'll have one. There you go. God, it's good to be old and nude. Charmise won't give me a divorce because she doesn't believe I'm gay. So, I need you to have sex with me while she watches. I have some demands. Yeah, of course, of course. Nobody can ever know. Absolutely, I'm right there with you on that one. There will be no kissing on the mouth. Okay. I changed my mind. There will be kissing on the mouth. Oh, uh, all right. Good. Now, what else? What else? Uh, yes, if perchance it is beautiful, I reserve the right to cry. Peter, I can't imagine any scenario where this is going to be beautiful. Can you notice that? Yeah. Can you notice anything in the world other than that? Only that fist-sized moth in a lampshade by the bed. I'm going to bed so that go-home time comes faster. Oh, my God. Oh, my, oh, my God. That's not funny. Y'all know I don't do bugs, bro. I'll just sleep with the light on. So what exactly is your plan here? I've got it all figured out, Brian. This tour will take us deep into the factory, and when the time is right, we'll slip away and find Rupert. Does anyone have any questions so far? Who's that up there? Oh, that's our gunman. Every once in a while, one of our toys becomes real, and we have to make sure it doesn't get out. Oh! Joe, why are you dressed like that? Because I'm a mixologist. Oh, cool. What can you make? You name it, I can make it. Could I get an old-fashioned? Classic. Rum and Coke coming right up. And could I get a Moscow Mule? Rum and Coke for my comrade. I'll have a whiskey Rum, Coke coming right up. Could I get a Rum and Coke? A Pepsi okay? <laughs> Stewie, that was all the money I brought. I knew I should have brought Peter instead of you. Oh, come on. You would have done much worse with him. He's got a terrible tell. <gasps> that is a pretty good tale. You know we have something. Any cards, Peter? No, I'm good. Peter? Is that you? Do I know you? It, it's me, Lyle, from the other side of the aquarium. I, I, I don't, I don't know you. I, I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. But I did know what he was talking about. I spent the next two and a half years cruising various aquariums. I never did find Lyle. Also, I didn't quite clear the table. I want to watch my show! Oh, no, Stewie's having a tantrum. I'm here, sweetie. Ow! Screw you, you little turd! What's all that noise? Oh, do you want a hug from your big sister? Ow! Wow. What a relief. For once, to talk with my real voice without the, the burden of trying to sound like someone I'm not. What do you mean by that? Well, this is my real voice. I don't hear a difference. How about now? You freaking hear that? What about now? Sound different? Giggity? What about now? Coming up now, this voice. Ahoy, it's me, and I'm a gay alien. I'm sorry, that just all sounds like the same person. <laughs> Stewie, you want a mommy rocket ride? What? What do you mean? Here we go. Get ready for blast off. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Ah! Oh, my God, Stewie, are you all right? Nice throw, Casey Anthony. <laughs> all right, I'm in. Me too. Let's do this. Whoa, whoa, Joe, Joe, what the hell? What? I thought, uh, find God was a code word. No, we meant literally go and find him. Oh. Well, I already texted Bonnie. Hey, Lois, how was your day? Terrible. I accidentally backed over a kid in the grocery store parking lot. <laughs> Peter, I'm serious. I ran right over the soft part of the face. 
I had to run away. I ditched the car and jumped on a passing train. I was so scared I didn't get off until I was in the South. What'd you do today? I pushed a boy behind your car so I could do all this harmonica stuff. It's all dirty in here. I don't care. Keep going. Shouldn't I wear some sort of protective suit? Why? Don't you trust me? I do, but our friend Bartholomew went in lots of chimneys in the 80s, and now he's sick. Oh, sorry. Today was y'all's cleaning day. Y'all want me to come back later? Maybe, maybe, yeah. Maybe, maybe another day. That's fine. I'll pull out. Just go easy. It really hurt on the way in. <laughs> Why do you keep a sleeping baby in your time machine room? I, I don't know. My decorator's terrible. Mm, yes, I'd like to return this printer. Wow, Brian, you've had quite a string of female guests spend the night lately. Yeah, whatever you're doing, it's working. You should see the way I have to pick up chicks. Hi. <laughs> More wine! More women! More table! <laughs> I'm having a heart attack! Is anyone at the table a doctor? I am! Come here! Hurry! Run! But the very far away doctor couldn't make it in time. And that's why here in Denmark, we have very small tables. Oh, this is lovely. Just lovely. How much is this? $1,200. Great. Great. That's all? And, and how late do you open this evening? Until 7. Perfect. Perfect. And you accept credit cards and cash? Yes. And what's your name? I want to make sure you get credit for this sale. Evan. Oh, that's a great name. You're wearing Sparrow wrappers for shoes, sir. There may have been a trade. <laughs> uh. <laughs> hey, hey, you think you could be with me right here in this place? Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry, Stewie. Yeah, it's, it's just, I met someone amazing the other day at the vet's office. So that's who you were texting with? Sort of, I, I was just rereading some of the texts I already sent her. <laughs> oh, that's good. You're Where'd rereading you your own texts? Yeah, do you, do you not do that? Nobody does that. God, I can already hear the jokes Jay Leno is going to be telling about our mayor. Oh, yeah? Like what? Oh, you know, it's like you can already hear them, you know? Like what? Like exactly what jokes do you hear? Tell me one of the jokes. Brian, all I have to do is start fake sneezing around you and you'll spend the rest of your life outside. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can hear some of the jokes. See you around, Brian. Definitely. Bye, Ellie. Is this the veterinarian's office? No, this is the veterinarian's. I think you want the veterinarian's center next door. Ah, I see the confusion. This That's must funny. happen all the time. We're ready for the German Shepherd. Yeah, that would be me. This is a very confusing lobby. Hey, Dad. Want to hear a story about my day at school? It's about my hot friend, Melissa. Okay. She didn't wear a bra to school today. Okay. And someone spilled water all over her white shirt. Yep. Okay. And it was cold, so you could see everything. Okay. Then she left, and I realized I was all alone. Smoke break! This is where a homeless man ate the finger of another homeless man. This is where some teenagers beat a gay guy to death. This building used to be Irish. Now it's Cambodian. And this is where fake tour guides throw rocks and steal tourists' wallets. Oh, yeah, I read about this part on Yelp. Oh! Vinny, you must be starving. What can I make you for dinner? Are you kidding? You're a hard-working lady. So tonight, I'm gonna make you dinner. Wow. <laughs> well, thank you, Vinny. Well, well, hang on, Lois. You promised me we were all eating my Play-Doh pasta tonight. Oh, Stewie, did you make something? Mmm. Oh, it's so yummy. Mmm. Nom, 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 nom. You better mean those nums. I dropped my phone in the toilet. Oh, oh, it's so cold and it's under everything. Uh, where is it? Oh, my God, oh. why haven't I found it yet? Oh. oh, no, I didn't roll my sleeve up far enough. Oh, why didn't I flush when I got in here? Oh, this isn't even all mine. Oh, no, there's a spider crawling on my face. Oh, why didn't I use the hand that was on the floor? Why did I use my toilet hand? No. Oh, wait, here it is behind the toilet. Good night. 
Do me a favor and don't wake me when you come up, though. Yes, you do. You always step on the creaky board. Yes, you do. Every time. Don't go to bed angry. Don't go to bed angry. Diffuse. Diffuse. I'm sorry. I overreacted. Now you say you're sorry. What do you mean, for what? I hate you! Ugh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I love you. I value you. We're not escalating. It's fine. I'll see you in the morning. Good night. I, I don't understand. All right, Griffin, you're clearly a smoker. This is my biggest accomplishment since my 1920 solo flight across the Atlantic. Viva Pierre Griffin! Incroyable! Don't look in there. Don't look in there. It's all craps. All right, we got to put toilets in these things if we're going to be in them for more than two hours. I can't go to sleep, Brian. I'm scared. Of what? Of death! Well, you're not alone. The world is full of people who can't accept death. And they've all got their own ideas of what happens when we die. Really? Like what? Tell me! I gotta say, it's weird to see you so worked up about this. I mean, you're not afraid of anything. Even that monster in your closet. Ah, he's on his way out of here. Ever since he violated the section of his lease that doesn't allow subletters. What are you talking about? I don't have anyone else in here. Just tell him the truth, Ethan. That must be the new nanny. Is this the Griffin house? Welcome oh my God. to this work environment. Oh, I'm not the nanny. I'm her Uber driver. Your nanny's still in the car. She dozed off on the way here. I not doze off, Uber. Was looking at crinkled photos of dead relatives. Hello, I am Natalia. What is favorite breakfast fish? Well, if you must know... <coughs> Welcome to this work environment. <sighs> What the hell? <sighs> Boom. Damn it. Ah! Oh my god, there's the CEO of my company. Now's my chance to impress him. Hey, Mr. Carlisle, check this out. That's what I can do for the company. Really? Can you do other things for the company? No, 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 I don't want to be promoted that way. I want to be promoted to shooting hawks with a crossbow way. Daddy, you're making a fool out of yourself. Why are you acting like this? Look, I've been trying to get into Reginald Barrington's inner circle for years. They've been the most elite family in this country ever since it was founded. They were the ones who invented the buckle on the hat. Hey, I like your zipper hat. I like your zipper hat. Morning, fellas. Oh, that's going to be a game changer. Yeah! Hey, Peter, my kid's selling Girl Scout cookies. And we're collecting for Jim's yep. pregnancy. Softball sign up? Oh. Trick or treat for UNICEF? Oh. Pitch in for Ed's retirement cake? Oh. Holiday party? Oh. Company picnic? Oh. Secret set? Oh. Carpool info? Oh. Oh, finally. Now I can get myself to the. Come on, Peter, let's call it. No, Joe! Nobody's leaving until I sink a penny in that glass. Oh, no. God's sake. Okay, this is the one. Son of a... Oh, my God. Chris is still in there. Somebody say... I gotta get out of this house. Boy, Dad sure seems excited. I know. I haven't seen him this giddy since he discovered that single loop roller coaster. <laughs> uh, don't feel so good. <laughs> Ew! 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 
Crash, are, are you awake? Crash, you do you wanna you want a Tom Brady kiss? Chris, wake up! I I want to give my son a Tom Brady kiss. Uh, 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 um. Who are you? I'm Zach Sawyer, and I go where I'm needed. Where are you headed? Wherever I'm needed. No, no, it does not work like that. I need to put address in machine. Okay, uh, maybe you can just take me home then. Where is home? I, I don't know. It's, it's my mom and dad's house, but I don't know the address. I take you airport. Okay. Oh. Chris, you doing okay? Oh. It's mom and dad. We thought we'd awakenings. Oh, Peter, I'm not sure that's okay. That's not okay. That's not You're okay. gonna hurt him if awakenings. He Peter, knock it off. What if I try it with a basketball? Awakenings. Oh God, that broke his nose. He didn't even flinch. It's bad. Let's do your thing. Let's let's twirl some toilet paper up into his nose and and then when we'll we'll do your thing. What type of shit? Ugh, what a night. Whoo! What a night. Crazy. Uh, yes, telegram for hungover. <laughs> yes, I, I'll sign for that. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, boy. <sighs> How was your night, Stewie? Ugh, get your own life, bro. Ah! Get off my sack. Ah! Ah! Peter, <laughs> I'd like to introduce the surgeon who will perform your procedure today. Oh, no. Dr. Wang Gan. Where do you think you're going? Look, I'm, I'm not actually going through with the operation. I'm going home. We're doing this whether you like it or not. Wait, 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 no, stop him! Somebody help! You want the Emmy, don't you? Yeah, yeah! And that is how I became your mother. Oh my god, possibly the scariest thing I've ever seen in my life. I bought this remote controlled toy helicopter to which I have attached this handgun. And I tell you, this thing is not easy to fly. Peter, that doesn't seem very. Here it goes! Now, I don't have anything to control the trigger with, so I put it on a timer. But I don't remember how long I set it. Ah, we're all gonna die! Okay, so now the bat has a gun and the knives I gave him. What? Why would you give him knives? I didn't think it would matter. I was counting on this helicopter thing working. <laughs> Not now! Not like this! <laughs> Peter, what the hell? You chose a turkey over me? I almost died! I swear to God, I thought dogs could breathe underwater. Holy crap, Lois! It's the treasure! Oh my God, Peter! You were right! Oh no, it's the one kid who also followed the treasure map. Oh, it's Diego from Door to Explorer. Oh, I'll take the cheeseburger meal. Would you like to make it an extra large meal? Uh. <laughs> no. Yes. No. You sure? It's only 29 cents more. Yes. No. Sounds like you're scared of monsters. So to help you get over it, here's Frankenstein. <coughs> Seriously? Well, that can't be possible. Because here comes Chris walking in the door right now. Hey, hey, hey. A rudely toot toot. Yeah, okay, whatever, Meg. Meg? You must be talking about me. A rudely toot toot. Ah. Do they all say a rudely toot toot? A lot of them, yeah. Get to let this delicious mother... Get him! Get his delicious ass! No homo. Where'd he go? He's not in here. Doctor, the alien attack has begun! We've got to return to the 21st century! Uh, we can't go into the time machine right now. But they're going to kill us all! All right, all right, just one second. So, how was your weekend? 
Oh, about that, we do not. Oh, my poor dog. He will die up there. Why is it shaped like a penis? Is that normal? Joke on them! I find happy dog planet. In 50 years, we all go back to Earth and bite everybody. But now we dance! No, there it is. I... I just can't take it. I discovered my wife's been cheating on me for a while. And I just... I can't live like this. I have to kill myself. Doesn't it make more sense to kill her? How are we doing on time? Less than a minute. How are you feeling, Chris? No different, except I have to poop from all this running. What? That's great! No time! They're closing the gate! <laughs> ah, it's coming! Oh my god! Yes, um, I'd like to make a return, please. And maybe take you to dinner? Brian, I don't care that I was diarrhea on. I care that you weren't honest. I care that I was diarrhea on. I care a great deal. Wow, I've never seen him run onto a baseball field when he wasn't chasing a duck or being chased by a duck. Hey, nice going, Chris! Wow, look how proud my dad is. Oh my god, a duck! It was a trap! <laughs> All right, remember to tell everyone who did this. Um, who are you guys supposed to be? Oh, come on, I'm James K. Polk. He's Millard Fillmore. He's William Henry Harrison. First president to die in office. You should have been FDR. Why? Because of the, you know. The wheelchair doesn't define me. And I'm Grover Cleveland. It's funny, because my name's Cleveland. Oh, damn it, Cleveland. Now we got to kill them all. This guy gets it first. Now, Chris, you're getting older, so it's time for you to learn the classic pool party game, talk to somebody's wife in a bikini until they cover up uncomfortably. So, Bonnie, how are things going? Oh, things are fine. Been kind of busy lately. What with Susie starting to... Okay, bye. Damn, that's like two seconds. Hey, Peter. Hey, what have you been watching on TV lately? Oh, you know, this and that. There's this show called Shipping Wars. It's actually kind of... Okay, bye. How's our little concussion guy? Oh, my God. Chris, he's worse off than I thought. We have to do something. Well, on TV, if somebody gets hit on the head, you hit him a second time, and that gets him back to normal. You see, what a concussion is, is the impact of brain matter on the inside of the skull. That's why you sometimes hear this nonsense about, oh, let's just give him better helmets. But you can't make a helmet for the inside of <laughs> Chris, are you crazy? Shh, let's just let him sleep this off. Officer Swanson, as you requested, here's a big stack of all the cases you've cracked. Oh, great. Now I'm going to go ahead and brood over a photo of the girl whose case was the one I couldn't solve. Thanks, Peter. You're welcome, Joe. Excuse me, do you have any tab soda I can bring back to the sex dungeon where I've been held captive for decades? Ma'am, this is a crime scene. I'm going to have to ask you to move along. You're right, Peter. I'm a pretty good cop. A yeah, very insensitive one, so, but a good cop nonetheless. Pantsuit. Hey, I'm Scott Fitzgerald. You probably don't recognize me because I'm in corporate. So am I. This is corporate. <laughs> Little too much so, if you ask me. <laughs> I, I try to have fun, right? I mean, you know, but we're, not, we're not landing planes here. Our company manufactures aircraft landing gear systems. Yep, uh-huh. Well, I am going to fly us over a few more drinks. Hold on, Peter. We can't go in there. We gotta wait for backup. The hell we do! Peter! Reach for the stars! Where are the drugs? There's no drugs here, pig. Aha! No drugs, huh? Well, what do you call this? And I bet there's more where that came from. They're trying to flush their stash. Nice try, scumbag, but I got your squishy drugs right here. Uh-oh. That'll be $16. $16? That's expensive. Yes, sir, everything's very expensive because you're paying for it on an iPad. Now, if you'll just select a gratuity, options are 60%, 90%, and 200%. Uh, I guess 60%? Okay, great. And just sign by dragging your bare finger across this thing. Okay. Thank you. Please make sure to bang your head on that low-hanging thing. What are you... Ah! Oh, you spilled something. You want a napkin? Yes, please. All right, here's 40 blown by the wind. 
Yes, you heard me right. Cancel my insurance. I've been in this location for 40 years, and never once have I broken a lamp. Good day, sir. God, I hope he's got insurance. Of course he's got insurance. <laughs> yep, just yes, got off you yourself then. Right. Cancel my husband's life insurance. He's been in perfect health for 40 years. We're selling the lamp store and going to travel. Good day, sir. Okay, fine. I guess it's just something I gotta deal with. Like the flush of a high-powered toilet. Would anyone like to lead the family in a holiday prayer? I'll tell you who should be saying his prayers. Santa. He messes with me, I mess with him. That's why I replaced one of his flying reindeer with an ordinary non-magical one. <laughs> cut it off! Cut it off! <laughs> you know, I think this year is gonna be the best... <laughs> Yay! Free horse! Hey! hey! Keep it down! Trying to get some sleep up here! Show us your boobs! My boobs? I, I don't think I... Oh, my! Jewelry! I wonder what I'll get for showing this. The rules of this city are very unclear. Hey, Chris. Uh, I wanted to talk about what happened at school. Is that a dead gerbil in there? That's a fur fish. It's a weird species. You put them in there and they swim like hell for like 30 seconds and then they go to sleep. This joker still hasn't woken up. Get up, lazy! <laughs> Peter, you sound so refined. Are you intelligent now? Affirmative. That means yes. Does that please you? It does, Peter. Well, it should. After all, knowledge is the ultimate aphrodisiac. Shall we away for relations? I'm not sure what you're saying, but let's hump. Affirmative. 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 Oh, my God! Affirmative! Wow, Peter, that was great. It was. Sorry I arrived early. Uh, I wanna... hope you guys enjoyed the video. This mug made me laugh, made more than I thought it would. I look forward to reacting to more of you guys' compilations. It's more Blasphemous HD. Twists.